It's time to play with the baby. Eat the eggs. Get your protein. <laughs> Bodybuilders say eggs are good for you. Eat them. Sonny, sign up, baby. It's his favorite thing. He loves this. Wait, throw, now throw an egg on him? This is like taking a kid to the park. This yeah, is his favorite thing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he's such a good little guy. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna make a baby Holy pizza. Holy fuck, it's stuck to him. <laughs> Wait, Chris, put him, put him down. He popped <laughs> on. Oh, my God. <laughs> he's an absolute... Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> baby sandwich. <laughs> Stupid. Am I think it randomly no, spawns it's you. Already. You literally. <laughs> you're Whoa. like. You're like. I can't believe it's still You're clipping to the him head. into objects and throwing <laughs> items on him. It's the funniest goddamn thing ever. Dude, he's got a scrape on his oh knee. Oh my you god. See that? I'm literally crying. Oh my god. It's a good game. Uh, it really is. Torrent, if you know this, um. This game just told you your carbon footprint matters, so you gotta stop. You gotta you gotta shut down those smokestacks you own. You guys don't know this, but Tomar literally opened smokestacks to pump pollution in the atmosphere <laughs> just for fun. Why are you telling everybody about my smokestacks? <laughs> Sorry, dude. man. You run those smokestacks. It's because guys, it's because he owns a bunch of property. And Do you Arctic, understand? And he, he owns property, in Arctic Circle. Those and he's banking on those Arctic are vintage smokestacks. I got a permit that when says I don't have to follow warms, any emission laws. You you need to be investigated because those when smokestacks the earth warms, were back in 1935. Tomar, when the earth warms, you're fucking land that's now in the Arctic Circle, which that's is now covered in, in, in frost, and permafrost will melt, and it'll become you know, farmable. That's why you're doing it, Those brother. Those smokestacks literally had not been run in 60 years, and I revived them. Yep. I revived an important part of Americana. Well? And nobody appreciates it. <laughs> I'm telling you, your carbon footprint do matter. Come on, give me one little flower. <laughs> <laughs> you had your chance. I think you I fucked know. it. That's literally maximum ownage, I'm sorry to say it. I hate to say it, but that ownage. Well, you look at Joshua Tomo. Joshua Tomo is a sick guy. He was on he was on that horrible island. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about Yoshi's Island, not the other. <laughs> do, you, do you remember when they the guy Knife! No. <laughs> no do, do you remember when the the guy uh he was selling he was selling Corey gets cut in half. <laughs> Sorry, go, go, go. No, it gets realistic fine. like that. <laughs> you can see a perfect split down the middle of Corey's anatomy. Is this a reference to Freaker <laughs> It's annoying orange. Oh yeah, it gets split. It's the like, apple. It gets Knife! Knife! Corey gets cut in half and he's talking. <laughs> Hey, Apple! <laughs> oh, Gets to a big dick that comes on screen. <laughs> Slap. He fucks a hole through him. Yeah. Jesus. Glory, he drills a glory hole through him. Alright. Oh Corey starts drooling. Ho ho ho. Oh, oh, that's fun, eh? Oh, oh, that's fun, eh? Oh, 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 what a fun. Uh. There really will be a fucking, like, YouTuber president in, like, 25 years. Probably. And it's Tyler gonna... Oakley. Yeah, ugh. I would actually just shit. I would just shit in my pants. I think one like centimeter string of shit would shoot in my ass <laughs> onto the, on, like a Spider-Man's web on the one ground. One centimeter string. That's the most foul visual. <laughs> a one centimeter string of shit. Why would you say that? You deserve that, bro. This is a Pokemon Center. Oh, they man. heal your Pokemon in no time at all. <laughs> You'll be relying on them a lot, so. Let go of my car! You better <laughs> learn about You're talking too hard! Let go of my car! <laughs> Your bullet's getting longer! This is a Pokemon Mart! <laughs> they sell balls for catching wild Pokemon and other useful oh, items. That's very really interesting. You're cutting off the circulation! The is out this way. <laughs> Trainers will be battling their prized Editor, Pokemon Can you draw there. red pixels, like, following them as they walk? No! <laughs> Leave the poor this editor alone. This editor's got to a feature like movie buddy. This is the this. sea, I'm as you can stupid. see! I'm stupid! Some Pokemon are found only in water. What if you walked into the water like Skylar? <laughs> 
His okay. dress floated up. And Hank starts shooting her scalp off. If only, Chris, you rewinded and didn't click yes. Fuck, I'm- <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> um, if there were zombies, I would use a katana and a boat. And if I there were zombies, I would hate to see it happen, but I would gladly kill my mummy and kill my stepdad <laughs> if I had to. <laughs> in a real situation where it's a they got infected, and yeah, where they got bit, yeah, I would have to do it, yeah. Monstro's giving us a golden shower. Wow, it's great. I think that's it's one of the Jimmy Timmy Power Hour. I had that on, the... v on VHS. Uh, which one? On VHS. I had I had the first Jimmy Timmy Power Hour. I bought on it in VHS. America. Yes. Why? That was in like 2000. It, it should, would have been on DVD, wouldn't it? Three? I don't, I don't think so. It was when I was let's see, 13. I was like, wow, Jimmy Chimmy Power Hour! It's Tarretroville! And now you get to burn alive. And then Com Comsmo say... Wanda! Comsmo! Comsmo say... And then say... Comsmo say, Wanda! Wanda! You, you're a pink wife of mine! <laughs> Wanda flying... You are a pink wife! She turned Jimmy's teacher into a creature. <laughs> <laughs> and he became a real screecher. <laughs> <laughs> no more was he a preacher of s who do you think learned this who do you, who, who is this child Pintinkio <laughs> <laughs> No I mean the voice actor Dude I want to make a cartoon called Pintinkio now <laughs> They uh, they surgeons would play this game Surgeons yeah. You're such a liar I'm telling the fucking truth That's not a joke <laughs> It's like Super Monkey Ball just <laughs> Roll around in there and take out his heart. <laughs> We're gonna roll a little monkey inside of you, and he's gonna get it out. A little monkey. There's something wrong with my ticker. <laughs> with me ticker. Get super monkey ball in <laughs> here. <laughs> we'll put a few monkeys in there. They'll get it out. One second, we're playing super monkey ball. <laughs> Ready? We're gonna we're gonna tilt the bed around a little bit. <laughs> super monkey ball is my favorite. I'm not I'm not kidding. I can't. It's about precision. I know it's about precision, but they could also play something like. So operation. They can play Operation. They can play Shrek Operation. Mm. What, what's in the Shrek Operation game? They had one. Really? Yes. You pull out Donkey's Duda. Why is he in there? Shut up. Piece of cake. Piece of shit. Sora, stop shitting. Stop it. I can't abide violence. <laughs> There's not enough room in the gummy toilet. It's not funny. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> I know I giggled once, but it's giggled. <laughs> I may be old. smiling while I'm talking. <laughs> but believe me, I'm distressed. <laughs> it's mostly shock, Sora. It's not endearment no more. I know you think you're real edgy with your shock humor, Sora, but it's gonna wear thin eventually. Goofy. <laughs> we fart here? I'll smell my old fart. I'll show it to you. He slowly appears in the picture. The fart? <laughs> <laughs> no, that goofy, but hey, goofy hey. like squatting and farting a big green cloud. I, I like that. <laughs> if you if you gone crazy, like Yo, that affects us. That's the pilot. That's the first episode. Yeah, it's like a house for cows. A house for cows. That's a good idea for a pilot. Instead of silly, let's make a house for cows. <laughs> Jesse. We have to house cows. <laughs> cows and cows. Well, like, where do we get the cows? We had a good thing, you stupid son of a bitch. We were housing cows. We had a good thing going. <laughs> this Captain America's famous frisbee disc. I go to the frizz. I go to the park and play frisbee with this disc every day. <laughs> So Captain America It says, never returns. I can never find I it. Can never, I throw it into the bushes and I never find it. <laughs> never. Read it. We've made progress, but none of it has been <laughs> ideal. <laughs> we developed a system to summon and contain these spirits. However, we've yet to find a suitable container. When the director first what summoned his daughter back from the dead, we were astonished. I can't see a foot in front of my face. It's so, it's so far. Stay here long without something proper to tether the spirits back to the earth. They the simply room fade off. away. We tried simple jars, vases. <laughs> And the like at first, but these containers limited the functions of the spirits. We've had minor successes using humanoid vessels. But the spirits are still tied to the physical damage of the containers and are thus too fragile. 
Okay, Tomer, so... Tomer, I couldn't... I didn't get any of that. Tomer, I... Can you... Can you read that again? It sounds like dolls are better for containing spirits than vases. Go figure. <laughs> took a whole scientist lab, like, fucking years to figure that out. There's some people who have actual sickening reactions to those kinds of sounds. Stephen Hawking, before he died, was working on a theory that said that if a skeleton were to yell, it would be called a yellaton. That's Dionysus <laughs> on the right. Wait, whose idea was it to play this? Zach? Well, we were no. supposed to play Yoshi's no, Story. Was, we were supposed to play the And N64 somehow it turned one. into, well, like, somehow turned into this one that nobody... Like, you said like, like, that like Shaggy. We can't, like, skip. <laughs> we can't skip Yoshi's oh, Story. Oh, this guy probably told me something important. Hover jump. Oh, holding B. Rub, rub, rub. You made two more jokes. That's where the... Tomo, you be scoot IRL of Scooby Man Scooby Doo with you. That still didn't work. Tomo, hit the fucking bank block, goddammit. Well, let's do IRL. Tomo, you're gonna you're being Scooby Doo for yeah. the first time. No, I guess we're not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? What Scooby did you Doo say? Scooby Doo was nonverbal till it was six. I guess Scooby Doo just <laughs> like looked at Scooby Doo looked at Tomo and uh, wa in part of ways they walked opposite directions. I guess <laughs> you, you just assumed he couldn't talk and yeah. let him keep walking. Yeah. That's crazy. Fuck is this a way? This is about me meeting Scooby Doo. Not anymore. Was, you was. Was. I wanted to try again. Thirty minutes ago, was about that. Look, I was focused on learning how to play this game. Next, next, next. Tomo, can you? Can't. What's that one on oh, the left? Oh, okay. What's that? Next to Yoshi. You fucking Did I just you can't count? What? I, I can't focus on two things at once. <laughs> Make so, X throw it. Look at that. He's going meow, meow, meow. <laughs> I'm trying to play the game. Oh, making eggs. Hold down. Push down this shit. Grab an enemy in the Y. Okay. Okay, I can make eggs like that. Uh, can, we get, please, can we please get fan art fan of Tomer making eggs? <laughs> please don't make fan art of me you making just eggs. Clip, play, editor, play what he just said. Oh, making eggs. Make fan art of me making eggs. Your Honor? That's Your in Honor? the game, you make eggs. Yes. I, That's obvious Tomer to everybody. Is guilty of laying the Tomer egg is hatching. Five eggs is a one. This is like the scientist. Wait, I already have five. I eggs. sentence him to sit on the eggs until they hatch. Thank you, Judge. Then Zach looks into the camera and says, what kind of an egg eggs. is this? And then I look up and say, Velociraptor? <laughs> and then what happens? The rest of the movie's really scary. It's weird. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> no! Time to go. This is what I'm that, talking oh about. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming for you. <laughs> What's he secreting? And the enzymes. Is that George Bush stealing the oil? Yeah. He flew to London mm -hmm. to make a deal with the devil. He was in front of Big Ben, and everyone <laughs> pointed up and said, "Look, it's George Bush. Why is he flying?" <laughs> He's wearing his Illuminati cloak again. That's he not me. I swear. <laughs> I didn't put the song. My George Bush sounds just like my George Lucas. What are you doing? <laughs> just do do both of them meeting. It's a meeting of the minds. I guess George Lucas is more whiny. Like, hello. Love Jar Jar. George was like, I love Jar Jar too. <laughs> he probably would say that. <laughs> it, was, it was funny. Jar Jar's pretty great. I knocked my Jar Jar. Do you think I could meet him sometime, watch. George? Wrote a Jar Jar fanfic where he steals oil. Then I did it. <laughs> <laughs> I blamed it on Jar Jar. George, I want to be in the next Jar Jar movie. You're George. I'm Lucas. We're both George. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> they both fucking mitosis and <laughs> no, they both merge together into the ultimate George. How do I make the new pages appear? You stomp on the book. What if instead of Sora go to any poor world, he close the book and throw it in the garbage? What if Sora said instead of Pooh Bear, he say Who Bear, and no one can find the bear? <laughs> Chris, why do these things make you laugh? Because, <laughs> because. I always visualize people saying them, and they're always really funny looking. Oh. I visualize the sweet Indian man. Yeah, he's making his parody cartoon <laughs> of Kingdom Hearts. He lives in a, a strange house with shit falling from he the heavens. He lives in a giant boot. Ew, a shiny pipe. 
Oh, fuck. Imagine if you will a shiny pipe. Imagine if you will a shiny pipe. I would absolutely hate the, the glistening pipe. driplets of the sky <laughs> are raining the, the down. glistening driplets. <laughs> <laughs> Upon your mellow brow. This episode of the Twilight Zone is called the driplets. What do you call it? <laughs> driplets. <laughs> your flip-flops pitter-patter against the shiny pipe as the driplets flip Imagine around. Imagine if you will. Chris O'Neill, age unknown. <laughs> 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 His flip-flops hit the droplets. His flip-flops create <laughs> splishes and splishes of the droplets. His, his, his little flip-flops cause his splishes in the puddle. Oh my god, are you... What are, are those what apes? Happening? What are they? Those are the passengers. I actually think it's really stupid that if they punch you in the back, it stops you. Yeah, it should push you forward, if anything. Dude, if this was real, I would actually probably do this while the zombie apocalypse. Like, actually this well. <laughs> Yeah, the fuck in things. fact, actually, my character can't do a flip like I can in real life. <laughs> so, if anything, it's actually more difficult for me to deal yeah, with Yeah, in real life, I'd be doing about ten, I'd be doing so ten times faster. better than this, yeah. yeah. You're so right. I'd, yeah, I'd be using backflips, and I'd be blocking them with my katana. Yeah, that's true. You did master the chain block, Tomar. <laughs> it's one of the fucking... St I felt really sad because I went over to my friend's house as a little kid, and we were picking the legs off of uh, Daddy Just Long. Just <laughs> <laughs> she was sitting asleep oh. in her chair. We we're uh, picking off little chunks of her legs. Her old, her old mouth was open. You just started pulling her legs off. Just little tiny, like using her fingernails to pick off little yep. segments. You're like, shh, shh, shh. She'd wake up and go, oh! <laughs> You really? No, no we, we were picking legs off of spiders until they were literally just balls. It was really fucked too. up. Dude, they, they, I don't think they have nervous. They don't like a nervous system. I don't think they can feel pain. That's like, still fucked up. I need to stop uh, going after the bonus levels. You know, I, I, no, I, don't, I, I actually don't think bugs don't have... Look, you shouldn't torture anything. Except for that thing right there. That's what I would... <laughs> that bug you could kill. I think chicken's fine as long as it's caked in like curry or something. I, I hate chicken on its own. Have you ever seen the how it's made for Indian curry? No. The Indian guy... Don't say something bad, Zach. Not, I, I wasn't going to. <laughs> yeah. But now that you've put me to the <laughs> test... <laughs> no, genuinely, uh, it's it's fascinating. So they get a big, like... I'm just waiting for the shit joke. When's <laughs> it coming? <laughs> shit. <laughs> An Indian guy lays on his back and holds his legs up in the air. <laughs> And he does some tummy crunches, and then he gets up, and then he goes and prepares the curry. He does some dead bugs. He does, he does some dead, <laughs> he does some dead he does, bugs he and tub girls bugs. into a big pot. And then he planks for a little bit, and then he does some mason twists, and then he doesn't shit in, he doesn't shit anywhere, and then he goes and makes the curry. What the fuck's wrong with you? I was... <laughs> <laughs> he does some, uh, he does some forearm curls, he does some pull-ups. Uh, uh, and then he shits into the other Indian guy's mouth and he shits into a plate. Damn it. <laughs> Wait, why'd she get mad? Do it your fucking self. Oh. She, found that, she found out how Indian curry was really made. Do you recognize all the Pokemon on the side? You got your birdie? There's Chirpot. <laughs> uh, round face. Brown brick. <laughs> brown brick is my favorite Pokemon. There's, <laughs> there's, <laughs> there's Pikachu as he should look. There's Pika Rat. There's Yellow Rat. Mm. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome. Catch me if you can. I don't want to. I have a scary story to tell about Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> tell me, blue. <laughs> One time I tried to turn the game off. But it didn't turn off! <laughs> Instead, I shocked my finger on it, kind of. <laughs> and I went, yikes! <laughs> Yowie zowie! My finger kablowie! <laughs> kablowie. Mother and father did not believe me. <laughs> <laughs> they squeezed my orange juice really badly that day to punish poured me. poured it in my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> what if you went into the deep jungles of the Congo? And you found a human being that has never seen civilization except for his little hut people. And then you trapped him in a room with a 60-inch well, screen. I can tell you this already. <laughs> you I showed him spike. I don't think I would have done that part. But what if you you had on loop flippers around? Oh my god! Around, he'd probably that'd be he'd the only, go insane. Well, he would. <laughs> he'd love how to say it. <laughs> <laughs> this poor, poor child. No, it's a 60-year-old man. Oh. I don't know why I thought a child. <laughs> Old man's funny. <laughs> There's no of him learning anything new. You'll show it to him and it will scare him and he won't learn from it. It scared me. <laughs>
<laughs> Can you imagine seeing that when you can't even exactly. comprehend the television? Exactly. It's so cool. I'd probably think it was like a portal to fucking like some kind of nightmare torture dimension. Can you turn him into a, a fool? I don't think that's uh well maybe with plastic surgery. This is just becoming real life now. This is just becoming just torturing someone for fun now. Well, <laughs> that's it, what it, it was from it the beginning. Already was that. Yeah, but like it's not causing no, you him... don't listen, you do not get to turn this around. It's not now, causing right? him like, pain. Well now that something came up that wasn't. It's causing him psychological end. distress. But if 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 you literally like mutilate his body to make him look like a fool <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's a different story. Well, yes, that, I didn't advocate Well Chris, that. what if you what if you destroyed him psychologically, so now he wants to become one. Oh well, my then god. You, then you make him one, and he's happy now. What well, Chris, you did that to him, though. You destroyed him mentally. But he's happy. <laughs> That's not him truly thinking that. I helped him. He used to worry about getting bit you by snakes. You didn't help him. You trapped now him in a room with that for like a year, like a so now he thinks he's a flugly. Yeah. That's not helping him. <laughs> it, it, we'll, That's corrupting we'll, him. We'll put him in a care home for flugly men. <laughs> <laughs> because you've done this After before. he gets the surgery, yeah. they'll try to undo it over the course of ten years. <laughs> He'll be in flugly therapy and he'll start recovering. They probably had to put you through physical therapy. We truly did help and save him. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to read the walls? I don't think uh, we've read the walls. You guys would you guys would have stopped this recording and watched the wall review by the Stalger Critic on YouTube? <laughs> why would you? Well, now I do. Why would you bring that up? Uh, we were all having a good time. I, I actually was looking at it earlier. I, I hadn't seen it in a few months, and I thought. How's this doing? That's probably still... the most like criticism he's ever gotten for, for doing yeah, I something. Think, yeah. The weird thing is it's not even <laughs> it's weird. It's it's not like the worst video he's ever made. It's just the weirdest one by far. Yeah. I mean, like, there's a lot of effort that clearly went into it. That's the weird part I, I about think it's it. The I feel like worst that is part of what makes it bad. The whole, yeah, exactly. Exactly. He's trying he's trying to one up Pig Floyd. That's why it's the I mean I don't, let's not go. He's into like this too shitting much. all over them while while acting like he's better than them. That's probably But he also doesn't get it. He he just mis yeah. completely misunderstood the whole point of the album. It's like what you said, when he watches Shrek or something, he literally doesn't get it's like, dude, you're not even, it's not even a high IQ thing to get Shrek, but he, he for some reason, there's some stuff he cannot figure out. It's like when I look I, at, like, rocket science, I'm like, I don't understand this. Hey. Ah, oh, help me. Ah. When was the last time you looked at rocket science? <laughs> yeah, really gave it a chance, <laughs> Chris. Tor just, poked a, Tor just poked a glary hole in your little theory there, Chris. I, your little... I guess it is pretty well, easy. I, I picked up rocket science like a weekend, I think. Yeah, no, it's kind of it's kind of the simplest thing. Tomer, whatever yeah, happened to your skeptic channel? My yeah, skeptic you channel. You yeah. debugged you debugged Christianity and you debugged SJWs for it's like true. five I years. It's true. I did it all with 100% <laughs> pinpoint accuracy, and they YouTube took me down because I was doing it too well. It, like the Vatican was calling them every day, and like it was a whole thing. Oh, well, you're, you, I mean, you're, you're, under, you're all through that account called the, oh, the, 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 the Pondering Llama, where it was you, it was you the llama <laughs> with, with, a, with a fedora, and you would float on, you'd float on screen up and down, you'd bob up and down. Surreal. The Pondering Llama. Oh, no, so real. Zach! I got it. My mommy gives me compliments on the cool videos my I My mommy says I'm fine. No, my mommy loves my me more. No, no. My mommy loves me more than your mommy loves you. My mommy loves me more than my mommy loves me more than mine. <laughs> but here's where you're wrong because my mommy said that she loves me more than my anything. mommy told me that. Well, she... my, my mommy said she was gonna feed me apple sauce to you. Did you ever have that like back and forth with your mom as a kid? She's like, I love you more. And your mom's like, I love you more. Yeah, that's probably happened to everybody at least once. But I think my mom was lying. Yeah, she she, she had like she a She knew I loved her more. She just didn't fucking accept it. She actually loves you a little bit less than you might expect. She would get angry when I when I confront her on the fact. My beautiful mother loves me oh, very much. Mother, should... I don't think I can my pull this father. out. My father. That's where we got that from. My yeah. father. My mother. My mother. <laughs> we suck. Yep. Yep. Uh, we're canceling future uploads. Chris, where you invite us? You invited everyone to your house, and you re you reenacted the nacho oh, the nacho scene from Better Call Saul. Where he's yelling us. at Hector. Yeah, you like reenacted it for us, and it was like thirty minutes of you reenacting it, but it was like good. It was good. I like I like prepared for like months for that. Chris always every few months he'll like invite everyone over, and he'll just do like a play in the middle of his I'll house. Do a scene, sure. He'll do like a scene or two. And I do, I really do take it seriously, He so. takes it really fucking seriously. You better not talk or, like, eat popcorn or, like, you know, throw peanuts or nothing like that when he's doing it. Maybe one day I'll put, I'll put him on YouTube. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think it'd be good. I mean, the fact that they're private is what makes them good, but I think maybe... 
I think the best one was when I rode that horse around and I was like about to like do that whole Lord of the Rings thing. Yeah, that but, yeah, you got the horse and everything. That the Michael Richards one was good. I think the Lord of the Rings one was <laughs> was good as well. The Michael Richards one. That one you really the put, laugh factory. You you practiced that one a lot. Like you got every every pause down perfectly. I had to just get into character. You really you believe we actually you got you got the audience. I went there to too. the laugh factory, I studied so hard. You hired the original guy that was really in the audience there. All of them. He was a robot. <laughs> Yeah, you, you just went to, you just redid it again. <laughs> you yeah. invite every single person who was there in 2006, and you make them relive it. And then I had to go on that stupid talk show. You went on Jay Leno. <laughs> and Tomar said, stop laughing, it's not funny. Stop laughing, it's not funny. Tomer fucked his lines. Yeah, he kept, for some reason, that was the phase where he kept saying L in every word. <laughs> Slappily, <laughs> What is it? Well, it's like it was, he was trying to do like Michael Jackson, right? Yeah. Where Michael Jackson like didn't actually talk like that, but he thought it'd be part of his brand. He was trying to like start a trend where everyone said L's in every single word. Yeah, yeah. He's like, that's gonna be like my mark. Yeah, that's the the English language will be Tomar fine. Did someone really do something? Did someone really do something like that? What is this psycho babble? Michael Jackson did it, kinda. Hello, do you do a time to learn? Time to learn. I don't even think he did that. It's not even fucking clever. But you little children, I mean, to laugh, to, to the lady. <laughs> oh. I shot Lewis. I don't know. That's what he would say every day. Uh. And nobody ever noticed. This is the multiverse Jackson. Yeah. I don't think real Jackson did that. <laughs> I think he was just kind of colloquially. I was just a little bit clookly. <laughs> you gotta leave me alone. I'm a little bit clookly and slimy. <laughs> <laughs> Blank Lilith. <laughs> Blank Lilith. It's been blind. Slum. I don't even remember why What's this bit language? started. What's the lisp again? What's this like is the... going off the rails. <laughs> that guy got freaking sprayed down. Oh. Ratata can learn surf. Ratatum. Ratatoing. They got Ratata. I've never watched Bell Ratatoing. Bulbasaur, Greeno, Pidgey, Bulbion, Sporeon, Groundstorm, and Lidgey. <laughs> <laughs> is that the Pokey Rap? Caterpie Sand True. Catch him, catch him, gotta catch him all. Can't escape! They got Bring Do Squing Do. Bumble Stingy. <laughs> I like Bring Do Squing Do. <laughs> Flippity Gingy Wingo and Stinky. <laughs> <Stingy. laughs> I like your Pokey Rap, Chris. Julian, drop me a beat, quick, go. Okay. okay. Catch him, catch him, gotta catch him all. Pokemon! They got Blimsty, Boras, Do Vladding and Inga, Pope Poppy, Misting Barbish. You're not even trying anymore. You're just scattering. Scoop Labadin Dabber, this is another thing. They got. Okay, they got FOMO, Bingo. Scoliosis, Stingo. Where the fuck is this thing around? They got Giuliano. Ding do. Christopherin. Christopherin? Ville, Virginia. Duckerville. <laughs> <laughs> they got Christian. He is a Pokemon. It's true. He becomes Christian Sonichu. Imagine her fingering my asshole. Imagine. No. You, you want me to imagine her fingering your asshole? <laughs> Someday I'm gonna, gonna be a, I'm gonna be a fully grown man and I'm gonna be out of the sense of humor and people are gonna use that clip on me. And yep. It's not gonna be fair. You're gonna have a tie on and be like. If you look at, uh, the account here with the same <laughs> and, someone's, and someone's gonna send that to your, like, your, your clients. Yep. I'm gonna say, that was a different Ooh, time. Squeeze that's, on in. Say, that's Everyone deep, used to talk like that. That's Everyone. a deep fake. This level looks cool. I go to sleep every night on a big bed of ravioli. Mama mia! 
you bring tell it. You, bro. My life never brought... shuts a damn bar. Hey, don't you carry me, Wicker. you never shut up. We're playing a Sonic game, and you're, you're fucking pretending to be your Mario. Hey, sit my wife. Hey, you're Do you remember that? I could, I could replace that fucking guy. Do you remember guy. What's his name? Yeah. What's his fucking name? John C. Riley. Yeah, John C. Riley <laughs> plays Mario. Guess what? Watch out. We're coming for you. Okay. We're coming for you, Zach, boys. Zach. Ah! Zach. Tomar. Your beautiful wife, Jaxie, eats a- eats a nasty old egg. It's like- it's really expired. <laughs> yeah? And her hand begins to turn into your hand. <laughs> what do you do, Tomar? Ow! It starts to get a little eggy looking. Yeah. So what do you do? Her her hand has a yellow subsurface Tomar, texture to it. you wake up and this guy is beating Jaxie with his big club. He's beating her yoke <laughs> into mush. You, he's got that big horrible club and he's fucking hitting her in the head. What do I do? Yeah, do you, do you open your safe and get your fucking gigantic like shotgun out? I guess out? I would. I would get my gun out. <laughs> Jesus. You told oh me God! You, told <laughs> me you, you save a giant blue fucking crocodile from Donkey Kong was beating your wife with in the fucking brain. With I the do whatever I could to, to <laughs> stop him. Yes. How many hits to the head do you think it would take to cause like brain, One. brain damage? What's it would like kill her instantly. It's got nails One. in it. Did you ever see the video of the of the guy who's like <laughs> does have nails? It's got fucking spikes in it. It says you had two when you purchased it, when you clicked it. I mean, I just bought two. You need to buy like five Pokeballs. Oh, ba baby Cory's here. I already bought five Pokeballs. Cory, your, your baby's here. Shut up. Oh, yeah, that's all you ever do. Cory, for his 18th birthday, you didn't do anything. That's why he's crying. Yeah, I put him in a roller scene and rolled him down the stairs. He's 18 years old. He right now. that. Cory, did you ever think of maybe the fact that you didn't raise him properly and he's 18, is why he acts like a baby is kind of a, a bad thing? Tomar, can you please adopt my child? Cory, uh, I mean, your son is 6 I foot 5. have one? I you're kind of <laughs> Corey! What do you- what do you give- you give him an iPad and just let him watch whatever he wanted? Maybe a bad oh, the, oh the only documentary I let my fucking, like, children watch is After Earth. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Corey, what the fuck are you talking about? After that's Earth? That's a Will Smith movie. What are you fucking talking about? Isn't it? Yes, that's a Will Smith movie! It's not a dog, you mean Planet Earth? <laughs> After <laughs> I was like, where did he get that from? I gotta get out of here. You know what? Fair play to her, dude. She really like is proving that she's more than just a thief. She's more. She's like. She's cut out for she's more. She's like a thief who can do magical parkour. Yeah, and defeat a dragon. <laughs> and breathe in a lot of ash. That's twice she's had to do it in her life now. <laughs> That's fucked up sex. I- what? I was saying because New York smog, not because of an event. Because of well, yeah, okay. She wasn't anywhere near that when that happened. You know what, if this game- <laughs> She's 21, so she wasn't even- Wait, was she No, born? she wasn't. Zach, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, she wasn't even alive during 9-11, so I rest my fucking case for if this. If this game- Go ahead. Had balls. Yep. Right? Yeah, we'd start with the towers collapsing with the dragon attacking That's the what I'm- like, imagine if, if the game ended with the dragon going through a portal and flying into the Twin Towers. That would be a- that'd be an amazing reveal. <laughs> and you? the government is like, the- the, the country could never know. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! The country like could never an know what happened here. Mr. President Bush? Yes, the dragon was- the dragon hit the towers. We gotta blame those Arabs. <laughs> we can use the dragon. <laughs> if I had a fucking- what the hell? Oh, need some help. We're all down. What happened? Yeah, get, take a guess what happened. Look who's shooting everyone's dead body. Take a guess. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm just trying to fix oh, the situation. Yeah. I'm already dead, Tomar. How bad is it? Just Whoa. You, you got me on <laughs> one health. That's amazing. <laughs> you fucking bastards all survived and I was the one who died. <laughs> That's what you get. Wait, I survived. I didn't do anything. Hold on. I'm joining back in. I'm taking How do Zach's I join back in? This is BS, man. I didn't think you could actually die in that situation, Zach. I would have let up. <laughs> I would have let up. I guess I hit him too hard. I didn't know I could kill somebody with a punch. My bad. <laughs> I shouldn't have hit him so hard. My bad. I killed him. Huh? Wait, is there no way we can get? Z do we just have to? No, we have to no, come across not, him now. No, no, I guess not, Tomar. I guess you were that one teammate. Sucks for you, doesn't it? You are kind of a dick, Tomar. Not gonna lie. <laughs> when Tomar made it, you guys are to kill Zach. Man, it was actually heartbreaking. <laughs> ah!
Well, you're a little completely quiet. Completely unprompted too. That's the sad thing about it. Zach was just my. I was I was sitting Tomar there reading my book. That, now that's a lie. Tomar got that crazy look in his Ooh. eye. Yeah, he looked like a madman. I did. To, I the, you know the lights were on, but no one was home. I knew something was wrong. <laughs> Tomar, Tomar has been trying out this new medication. You know. Yeah, Tomar's been telling me every day he's been on this new medication. He hadn't been the same since. He's just got a different look in his eye. Like like oh, the yeah. lights are on, but Stop. no one's home. Ever since he started that new medication. For you know, <laughs> thing. <laughs> it has you pegged, dude. You guys are really mean. Okay, so so all I did was defend rude. myself. You'll, you'll do a quadruple homicide without thinking twice because you're How? a relentless <laughs> monster. What was the Japanese joke we made before we went to get sushi? What Japanese joke? I made a Japanese accent getting off the elevator. Oh, yeah, what did you say? It was really funny, but I didn't want to say it because we were in public. <laughs> I forget. There's someone getting yelled at by a Japanese. Oh, it was Chris Chan if he was working a sushi oh, yeah. place. <laughs> <laughs> you want your sushi? Does he say, I'm working on it? <laughs> then he goes, Let me tell you. <laughs> if the health of the department. <laughs> know what you are putting you in our cannot, sushi. You cannot pepper spray the customers, Chris Chan. You cannot pepper spray the sushi. <laughs> Not they could good. condemn our restaurant. It's not a real pepper. <laughs> and we would have to move out of it. You gotta call it pepper spray if it's not pepper. Fucking <laughs> You chop the sushi, you unchop the sushi. I thought you were really Japanese. Japanese? Because your name is Christian. <laughs> Christian, I get it. Now I see you are Christian. just Christian. Bad. <laughs> Yes, he's upside down. <laughs> can make him make the face. Oh God, help me! <laughs> Chris is okay, I saw Mitching. I have a, an allergic reaction to my cat. You should throw him out. Maybe he needs a bath. You think? Yeah. I don't think so. I think cats just produce Milk. parasites from their eyeballs. I agree. <laughs> I know that if you pet a cat and you rub your eyes, it's very bad. You I know if you that. give a mouse a cookie. That's yeah. It. He eats it. <laughs> you just reminded me of my dad. Fine. When I was younger, my dad used to leave cookies out for mice in our kitchen, and the cookie or the mouse. Did he ever read the book? My mouse would run up and grab the cookie, and my dad would smack it on the head with a hammer. Your mouse. Aww. Yeah. You had a mouse. Yeah, I called him Hammerhead. Hammer pants. Because you took a hammer to his head. My dad did. Oh my god. I'll take a hammer to you. Said. Your, look, your, your fucking mouse keeps taking my cookie. Cookie. <laughs> he grabbed the hammer and bonked him. That's a, I like I like he, the way your people speak. So what right? was he named before then? Uh, normal head. <laughs> normal head. <laughs> normal head the mouse. <laughs> My dad kept smacking him on the head, so he had to replace him every day with a new mouse, and he had to keep tricking me into thinking it was the same mouse. He's complete. He had to keep giving the mice plastic surgery to look the same. <laughs> Who's this? Can you imagine that little tiny <laughs> mouse plastic surgery? Yeah, my dad had to train the other two mice to be doctors for plastic surgery. They would oh. give him big boobies. No, we he can, never gave normal can, head big boobies. We can work at tutors. <laughs> mouse tutors. Do you guys Wait. ever see uh, a man trying to step on a mouse, but he steps on it too hard and squashes it, and then he slips on it and flies out on the road and gets run over? That would make me very sad for the mouse. Is that your favorite? <laughs> Is that your favorite YouTube video? Yeah, man. Man, <laughs> man steps on my mouse, but crushes it, and he slips, and what, what did flies you say? He out flies window. out into the road and gets run over by another mouse. By another, what is it's it? So giant? That, <laughs> a mouse crawls over. Tiny mouse. <laughs> He's laying in the road and goes, "No!" <laughs> a little tiny mouse crawls over him. Yeah, destroying his body. <laughs> he mangles him. Shaggy walks up to Shadow. What does he say? He's like, look, you look exactly like my dog, Scooby! <laughs> He's like, what the hell are you talking about? Oh, you know what's sick? That actually <laughs> would be what the crossover would be. <laughs> like you, but come, come, like, come on, Scooby! Come on, Scooby! Come I'm, 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 I'm not a dog. I'm not a dog, damn idiot! Scooby, you're acting weird! <laughs> 
Lex, go check out this fucking. <laughs> that is hilarious, Corey. That is the funniest Sonic parody I've heard in a long time. What can I say? I thought of it myself, Dorkly. Like I thought of no, it. No, that's actually funny though. It's cuts just... to Dorkly artist being killed. <laughs> Slams his hand out in anger. He didn't get to it first. The idea of so, like just any cartoon being mistaken and like, I know it's, it's perfect. It's fucking it's funny. So easy. <laughs> and then they're like, trying, they're like, okay, gang, let's solve the mystery. And Shadow's like, oh, chaos control will make it so much easier. This is funny, but it's so like, borderline so that it makes it even up. so this fucking is awful. This is something you'd see uh, drawn on, on like uh, DeviantArt or something. Maybe low. <laughs> I'm not a dog. Come on, Scoop, we gotta <laughs> Come on, go. Scoop, let's get this double decker. <laughs> How can you Scooby Snack? Uh, what is this? Human oh, food? That's pretty good. He's like Scooby <laughs> Snack. <laughs> Roll over, let me give you a red rocket. <laughs> oh, the damn. <laughs> let damn, me damn, suck that... your doggy dick. <laughs> what? Damn, that feels good. I gotta like... get out of chaos control. Damn, this is nice. Warps to Daphne, <laughs> she starts sucking his red rocket. <laughs> damn. <laughs> Damn, not here. Yeah. How many times are you gonna say damn? How many times are you gonna fucking say damn? Shadow says. Have, have a damn cat. The only thing Shadow says is damn, damn, damn. not damn. here. And when he said damn chaos, I'm rolling. He's just warping around, getting sucked out by all of the screaming humans. Yeah, he's like, yeah. <laughs> they're he's all like, just like Scooby, oh, are you okay? Quite alarming. Like, you look even, scared. Even, like, even the help. swamp, even the swamp monster. What, Bella, the, back the swamp monster <laughs> <laughs> falls on top of him, sucks him off. That's like, genius. <laughs> that, that would be a really good idea for a cartoon. Scooby, dumb. What? Oh, I really okay. If what? You're if a cousin, Scooby. It's funny you brought up Scooby Doo because I remember you talked about this a while ago. You were like, "What was the first cartoon you ever watched?" Scooby Doo was the first cartoon. Mm. Like I watched cartoons on TV, but it was like PBS Kids and shit. But it was never like a cartoon. Was it your first to see Cory Do? <laughs> no, <laughs> I actually don't know what my first to see was. Becky Do. Cory. <laughs> You say Cory Dory do. Yeah, my, uh, my, uh, my first OC Corey was a Dory shaggy do? recolor because I love this character Wait, so much. My food just got dropped off. It did? Yeah. Like your food just got dropped off. How long, off. How long have we been growing for? Like, think, like, is that Richard Nixon that from long. Futurama? How long have we been going for, Scooby Doo? That's perfect Nixon from Futurama. That's perfect Nixon from Futurama. <laughs> I've evolved like into him. perfect Nixon. How <laughs> long? <laughs> I've evolved. This is my final form. Oh, anyways, get perfect next to the drama. Oh, I've already done that for years. That is perfect next in from Futurama. Thank you, boys. Come here. I just want to give you this prestigious award. What is this award for? I like how she's kissing Nixon's fucking glass jar while she's going. Corey, I just want to say. I just want to say. I think the government should investigate. Trump. Investigate the Corey's government hard totally drive. sucks you, motherfucker. I believe with all my heart that Corey's hard drive should be investigated. <laughs> I don't believe well, he's an I got, honest... I got news for you, I think you're President a dishonest Nixon. Man. It would literally just be... Oh, that was a bad idea. I've seen the porn you've drawn. Well, you could say that in some ways Corey started the HIV pandemic. <laughs> HIV pandemic? Oh, I wish this was more like The Legend of Zelda and Pokemon and Mario. Oh. <sighs> hey, Chris, you have to ask me what's wrong, really. Okay. It'd be really funny, too, really. <sighs> oh, what's wrong? There's no goobers in the real world. <laughs> <laughs> See? I told you it would be the funniest thing you've ever heard. Oh, it is, it is funny. <laughs> that is funny. What would, you do if somebody, what, if, what would you do if your dad said that to you the next time you saw me? Would, oh, <sighs> okay, what? here's the scenario. Okay. Uh, you go to your mommy's house. Okay. She's like, Sigh, it's been kind of boring around here, Sigh. She, like, uh, crosses her legs and puts her face down on the table in boredom. Is she hot? She's hot. And then you're like, Mummy, I brought over something for you to stop being so bored all the time. And hot. And then you put down, like, a, an, an NES. It's got Mario on it. Okay. And she goes, ah, I'm not really into this, Sigh. And you're like, just give it a try. And then the next time you come over, now she's, like, depressed. She's like, why is there no Goombas in the real world? You introducing this thing made her it like. Made her. She's just mad that it's it's like when people, it's like when people left the Avatar movie and they're like the real world is a yeah. boring, <laughs> except for it's over a SNES game. You were trying to help her, but you, I just you, gave I gave her like like Pong for, extra yeah, depression. Yeah, she, yeah, yeah she's, she's having a. I wish I could play Pong in real life. Or she has or, Pandora <laughs> fucking. What, what do you call that? Pandoraitis. Yeah. Yeah. Or it's like fucking uh, Inception where she doesn't believe the real world is. <laughs> She's like, she's like, wait, are you my son or is this game my son? I don't know. 
Or is Mario my is son? Is Mario my son? Are you Mario? I've no, been no. trapped in the gaming world for too long. Mommy, it's me. I'm not Mario. Mom, use your peripheral vision to look away from the TV. It's not real. Who said that? Did Mom! I, did Mario say this to me? What, awesome. what other movies can we work into this? Um... Uh, her unborn baby bursts from her tummy like an alien. Whose does? Your mom's. You guys said that in unison like you were in church. Yeah, well, we Your know mom. what bet, is well, up with her because we've been spending time with her when you <laughs> haven't. If you had a supercomputer, like, uh, we had the best AI ever on it, right? And if you asked it, who out there definitely wants me to die, right? And you searched it and it showed you every person that definitely wants you to die. And that is a joke. Not as a joke, right? Not yeah. as a bit. Now, Not as a bit, yeah. one night you're out driving around on your Harley Davidson in the desert, and you pull yep. into a gas station, and you go for a wee, and then standing next to you in the urinal is the guy that wants you dead, but he hasn't noticed you yet, right? Right? Yeah, yeah, he yeah. He slips on piss, cracks his head on the sink, and now he's passed out, right? So now you can tie him to the back of your Harley Davidson and drive, drive him out into the woods, and now, what do you do? Wait, so I've already made the decision to tie his feet to the back of my motorcycle and drag him like five miles. <laughs> yeah, but his uh, biker jacket is keeping him safe. Like so his head's not like hitting. His head's not like he's like, completely safe, and you're bringing him to the to the cabin. So he doesn't become like tomato soup yet. No, he's him. completely safe inside of his cool biker jacket. So I've already jacket. made the decision to fucking kidnap the guy. Yes, because you know that he wants to kill you. He just hasn't noticed you yet, and he passed out. But Do how you... can I explain to anyone that I know he wants to you kill me? You can't. You, only your supercomputer knows that. So what? what's the hype? What, do I torture him is what you're asking? What do you do? At all. Is he awake? No. Yes. And by the way, you asked your computer, like, what does this guy want to do? Oh, he wants to, like, cut you up and he wants to, like, murder you and, and, like, torture you and cut your fingers off and cut your nose off, cut your ears off, cut your dick off and cut your ass cheeks off and your fingers and your toes and that, blind you. That Well, that is definitely is a good. So what I would do is probably, well, what? so you're saying, and I, and am I allowed to do that back to him? I allowed to you do can do whatever the fuck you want. Uh... I would skin him alive. <laughs> and then wear his skin and become him. That's a cool power fantasy and all, but what would you actually then, really listen, do? Listen, I would skin him alive, and then I would wear his skin, and then say I'm that guy and ruin his life, and then put his skin back on. And he'd be like a big red meat guy, and he'd go, Why'd you do it to my skin? And I'd be, I'd be like, shut up, and I'd knock him out again, and I'd put the skin back on him, and then I'd send him back on his way, and then nobody would believe him that I, he, I wore his skin. Yeah, but he remembers. Well, that's why I take apart. I I I remove part of his brain. <laughs> you lobotomize yeah, him. I lobotomize him and then send him back out into the world. Okay. So See, Zach, I don't think that's a serious answer. I don't think you do that. You don't think I'd really skin the I guy alive? I don't think you'd really do that. Um. All right, then I would just chop his head off and and uh, kick it around. I think that's a very difficult question. I don't know what I'd do. Well, it's a hard hypothetical because I've already fucking kidnapped him, <laughs> and he's got like brain. I've already committed a crime. Like, there's a guy out there that you 100% know for certain would kill you if he ran into you and had the jump on you. Exactly, so why have I taken him into my house where he's gonna wake up and instantly kill me? He's tied up, you tied him up. So I've tied- exactly, but if I let him go, he's definitely gonna kill me now. Exactly! Because he wanted to kill me! What would you do? It's such a scary question. I'd fucking kill him then, I guess. You would kinda have to, but you don't want to. I, I, would, I would have to kill him because I kidnapped him, but I didn't have to kidnap him. <laughs> if I saw the guy slip, I would just leave. <laughs> Because I've already kidnapped him, which means he's gonna kill- But I, that means he's still out there, and you know he'd still kill you if you ran into him again. When you say he would kill me, does yes. he want to kill me? Yes, or he, he wants you or dead. Or he actually would kill me if he could. He, he would kill you, and he wants to kill you. Well, Zach thinks, Law, what would you do? Uh... I, I'd kill him, motherfucker. <laughs> Jesus, you're yeah. psycho. Yeah, man. I mean, you you came up with this scenario. I'm just ordering from the menu. I just think it's a good hypothetical. What the fuck? What would you do? What would you do? I don't think this? there's really, like, realistically any way to know 100% that someone will kill you. If somebody is, like, actively threatening you, then they've made the threat, and if they had... If I look at the Gates has... He's gone online and said, My supercomputer super is 100% accurate with its predictions. 
He's not lying. He's He's got his hand on a Bible but saying what, that. But what if the guy that made the computer hates this guy and is trying to do 40 chests to get me to kill his enemy by oh, making me think... Fucked. You know what I mean? That's a scary ending. Yeah, see? That's a good twist. That's a good Black Mirror episode. That's a really good Black... Hey, that, Charlie, whatever the fuck, don't Charlie steal Hebdo, that. Charlie Hebdo, fucking don't steal That's our idea. idea, and it's worth a lot of money, so And don't I know steal you've it. already done Facebook Becomes Evil and Twitter Becomes Evil, but don't steal our good idea, okay, yeah. you fucking idiot? Yeah. Don't I, steal AI Becomes Evil. That's... Yeah, that's a new idea. <laughs> Oh, it's Polar! Oh, he's my man. boy! He wouldn't kill his child. What, what? fuck? Well, now he has to. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> See the face he made? Oh! <laughs> my baby! Well, that's what happens. Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh, he's happy you Fuck killed you, him. Fuck you, child. <laughs> <laughs> I always hated you. <laughs> It's to make up his mind. What is he raising his eyebrows at? The other polar bear? <laughs> I'm going to take your child, ma'am. Ma'am. Wah. <laughs> Doing the trick! No, I want to do the Fuck trick! Fuck you and your trick! I want to do the I trick! I knew the trick! I found Fuck this out this on my own! I didn't I read it on my own! Ah! I didn't fucking know, but I, I knew I about it! I knew it! I hate him! 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 I So what's this? Oh. What, what's his problem? What's his story? Oh my god, there's a car crash? You got killed by a fucking rotting gator. Yeah, those guys don't like directly hurt you, they just like shove you. That's pretty much, uh, terrorism. Yeah, yeah, that's basically the, 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 the domestic terrorism. That's what the ISIS guys did, right? They just shoved people around? Yeah, they just, they, they, they sat in barrels and went, oh! <laughs> and ha ha ha! Ha ha ha, yeah. That's how they captured Mosul. What do you think would be the silliest yet most intimidating way for ISIS to to make fun of or to to make us feel to, threatened? To intimidate the American public? Yeah, like like what if if they made a video of them all riding rhinos in the desert? It'd be fucking terrifying. Because also <laughs> rhinos aren't even native to the Middle East. Only, I know like, you, Africa, you just right? have to think like, wow, they must be rich to get them out there. If, I, they had like billions of dollars at one point. I could totally if they, yeah, if they rented out like a thousand rhinos or like or and they, they cut to them like like a thousand of those guys. Yeah. In the desert. Yeah. With epic spears. How did they how did they lose their money so fast? Uh their oil got cut off. And they spent it all on Pokemon cards. They spent, spent it all on rare Pokemon cards. <laughs> Magic the gathering. I don't definitely need holographic cards. <laughs> they did unboxing on un Pokemon unboxing on un un unwrapping videos on YouTube. Oh, look at look that, that sucks. Look at that I could make a better game with my arms tied behind my game development team. I could make a better game with my oh. ass tied behind my back. <laughs> my ass tied. Oh yeah, uh, Tomar, remember when we were talking about eating ass? You were like, I like referring to that as chewing gum. That was fucking disgusting, <laughs> what dude. What, what the fuck's wrong with did you? Really, did you really fucking say that, dude? No. <laughs> You're fucking nasty. <laughs> I've never used uh. that expression. All right, here's what's going to happen. not judgmental about the concept of eating ass. Oh. <laughs> here's what's going to happen. Tomar. The comments will be disabled on this video. The ratings will be disabled on this video. <laughs> if anyone dislikes this video, you'll be probably blocked from this channel. Here's the other thing that's going to happen. If you leave a negative comment on Twitter, Tomar, YouTube, come on, Tomar. Oh man, it was I, I was beating these guys back with my frying pan. My frying pan. Tomer's new song. My frying oh, pan. My frying pan. Me. Let me in with my frying pan. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, cool. Oh. My friend Lyle, he's dying. He's like, how fast can you count? But you only count every third number. <laughs> wait, wait. So I start on one or start on zero? Start on one. So one, four, or one? Yeah, one, four. This sucks. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> you just, I, you I don't want to admit do, you're I can, stupid. I can, I can do three, six, nine, twelve. Uh, but that's 15, too easy. 18, Everyone knows 21. that. <laughs> okay, so one, four, seven, <laughs> eleven. Four, am I wrong? No, I was just being an <laughs> asshole. Wait, yeah, you were. It would have been ten. And also, who what? cares? Wait, 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 wait. One, and you're four, retarded. Seven, yeah, ten. Oh, wait, you are wrong. Thirteen. I'm smart. You're 16, stupid. 19. You fucking heard me say the right answer and disagree <laughs> with it. Okay. No! Oh, uh, I'm Lyle. I know E equals MC squared. Fuck you. <laughs> not everyone's Einstein and smart and has a big mustache. Hey, Lyle Stein. Smart Lyle Stein, person Lyle would not be engaging <laughs> with this. Hey, Professor Lyle Stein. Why don't you start from 21 and take it from there? Start from 21 and yeah, add three. Yeah, go fast, 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 fast. 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 36, 39, 42. This is Stupid. Uh, you were okay, wrong. Now, now, do, now do seven. 
No. Yes. I'm not engaging with this. You, not... you memorized this beforehand, by the way. I'm playing the fucking game this. and by doing way, guys, this. Every episode Shut of Bonnie Plays is scripted. He memorized the fucking script. He subconsciously planted this question in my head to Don't ask him for later. Oh, you have to wait in the gap. Stop landing in that fucking... <laughs> no, it's funny if I land in the lava. Stop landing in the elephant's foot right now. Is the elephant's foot that secret artifact? It's the thing in Chernobyl that when you touch it, you grow really big. I went big. to the beach. Oh, yeah, it is, I went to the it? beach with Lyle and he said, look at my elephant's foot. And he pulled out his, <laughs> he pulled out his bathing trunks and you'll know where it goes from there. Oh, the like, day, yep. like his... Yeah, it was, it looked all lumpy and it was it's radiating. Gray. It was going, zzz, zzz. It's gray. It's got hairs going all the it way down. It's making that cartoon radiation sound effect. Zzz, 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 zzz. Okay, all right, we're good now. Last time on Sonic Heroes, Dr. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Nothing happened. <laughs> well, yeah, what happened? You can still go. You can still say what happened. Last <laughs> time on Sonic Last Heroes. Last time on Sonic Heroes. Sonic and Shadow Sonic were deep Heroes. in battle. Sonic and Shadow were... They Actually, were kissing each other on the chain. Last time on Sonic Damn. Heroes, we Damn. fought the last Ooh, boss stop for the fourth me. time. Stop <laughs> kissing me, hedgehog. You're also a hedgehog. <laughs> and you're stop. good at kissing, too. <laughs> stop. Stop. Mm. stop. I'm not into this. But I kind of like it. Right. Damn. So, uh, Maria. Damn. So, Maria. You're not Maria. <laughs> you're, wait a minute. <laughs> you're a blue Maria. <laughs> That's right. Yep. You said it. Is he sucking him off while he's saying that? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Somebody is we've done that 100. Maria. We've done 100. We've done 100. <laughs> What's better? Yeah. Auschwitz? Mm -hmm. Or a biscuit? <laughs> <laughs> a biscuit. Um, I'm gonna take a guess. Okay. I didn't say which Auschwitz. Oh. <laughs> There's more. I'm just talking about the area. There's a donut area, shop the down camp. the street called Auschwitz. <laughs> There's a whole town of Auschwitz. There's Where a candy it? shop called Auschwitz. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Auschwitz! <laughs> <laughs> Osama bin. Rock candy. What, what does this have to do with them? Because all the stuff they sell is really offensive. <laughs> Twin taffies. <laughs> Armenian suckers. Was he Armenian? Who, uh, Hitler? Yeah. Not. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Chris. Chris! He was was he a Hermitian? He was Afghani, wasn't he? Yeah. Uh, yeah absolutely, that's right. <laughs> he would street race all the time. <laughs> South Africa. Our, oh Imagine Hitler God. street racing. <laughs> don't we know it? Don't we know it? Guys, you don't get it. I'm brown, I can say that. You can't, though. Am I you're, right? You're not Armenian. I'm Moroccan, not Moroccans. You're Morocco I think Mole. I stole that from Mexicans. Really? Yeah. What do you think is the worst thing that Miyamoto ever actually said? Uh. Like, hypothetically speaking. Go home and wait to pig. He probably has said that at some point. Uh, there's one photo of him showed on screen when he when he was throwing the Pikmin at the audience at E3. Oh yeah, and he looks really angry. Yeah, he looks really unhappy. <laughs> he, he, he got, he got uh, a little fit of rage and he started attacking the audience. Do you, do you think behind closed doors, he like grabs Reggie, Reggie by the collar and drags him into Reggie a- Reggie would grab him by the collar? No, Miyamoto grabs Reggie by the collar and drags him to a room and starts hitting him. <laughs> what are you going to Like for no particular reason, like fucking Ren and Stimpy. <laughs> Stupid fucking American. <laughs> Reggie's scary. Reggie? Yeah. Reggie's not scary. He looks like a yeah, Frankenstein. He yeah, he looks like a monster. If you freeze frame any point of time when he's talking, he always makes a really ridiculous face. Because he doesn't have a normal facial structure. He looks like he was grown in a petri dish. Alright, uh, Chris. Uh -huh. Oh my god, am I missing two fucking Can we candles? Hear your best impression of the Noid. You know, you know the Noid. Yeah. You know I'm the Noid, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, Yo, describe him. Little red guy. Okay. 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 Little red guy, big floppy ears. Right. Yep. 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 He's got a big N on his chest. And like, what does he love? Is that all he has? Pizza. Okay. Well, now we're now we're cooking with gas. So, so you got that guy in your head, mental image, like, like wearing like a cock stretcher. He's a doing cock that. Stretcher? Yeah. Like okay. He's got hours a cock stretcher a on. And you want me to do an impression of him yeah, with the cock like, stretcher? What, what that might sound like as he's putting the device on, like... Okay. Alright. So, Here's Noid the... with a cock stretcher. Yeah. 
<laughs> well, that's, I mean, that's, so that's, so that's it. That's all I just wanted. You know, I just wanted to see what you. You wanted an image. You know, that's all I, I needed. A split second image. <laughs> that's all I needed. I'm satiated now. I just, you know, it's like I felt like I was in the desert and I had a little scoop of water in my hands and I just drank I, it up. I'm, I'm, I'm let satiated. me just say, I really like that. That's all I needed. I that really drink. like the setup to that. What if and the payoff? Was that's a Marvel. What if? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Cock stretcher. What if it? What if? What if the noid what ended? If? The noid. I think I know where I need How to go. How the noid should have ended. <laughs> He stretches his cock out. Uh, yeah. he, he does have a funny scream he if you popped, ever hear it. His dick pop. It, it's, and he goes, ah! Take my scream and like uh, increase the pitch times like 300%. But show the noid when that happens. <laughs> yeah. So that we really feel like we're seeing the noid actually. Show him in pain. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Your yo noid oh. sounds like an old man. No. Oh, it sounds like no. a normal man oh. in pain. Well, the noid, noid. Was, did, would he age? He's just like, he, he, would pl he you know. There'd be like an old Noid is what I'm saying, right? Eventually? Yo, I want to see the old man Noid with, without his, clo his clothes on. Yeah, take your clothes off and just be an old man Noid. <laughs> Are there actual rabbit ears beneath his thing or is no, that part of the costume? No, that's, like, that's a costume. That's not actually... That's, you're saying it's not actually his... Well, I mean, he has a human face. I don't know. We're going to find a clue here, I bet. You should take that soccer ball. Oh! <laughs> now, just, just so everybody knows, one of Tomar's eyes is about three times the size of the other because he always holds up a magnifying glass to it looks for clues. So if you ever, you ever draw a fan out of Tomar, make sure he's holding up a magnifying glass and looking <laughs> oh, for God. clues. They'd have and draw a little black I parasite in his eye. I usually find clues to my credit. He does usually find clues. You know what though, we are so late on this. Yeah. Is, is up, up. We're so late on this that it actually has become, it's kind of flipped there and become fashionable because we're like, it's come, years. yeah, no, it's come full circle, I think. If we had done this in 2015, it would have felt like uh, bad, but this feels actually really cool. Keep making excuses, I, Zach. <laughs> Keep making excuses. <laughs> no. And I'll tell you what, if anybody criticizes us in the comments, they're bots, they're bought and paid for by our competition, <laughs> yeah. and they're not real people. Nobody <laughs> the other Let's this. Plays that we have drama with are all paying for the bots, so... Yeah, dude, I, by the way, uh, I literally had- I, I saw the deposition of our opponent who I sued, I took the fucking court. I did deposition, he admitted he spent $45,000 on bots and- and botted views. You're going down, dude! Any mass flag their videos. Your empire's collapsing around you. Yeah. <laughs> The DMs are leaked, yeah, dude. The DMs are out there. You're fucked. You're fucked. Quit now. We're the only cop, but get out. This is autistic as hell. Tomar, Tomar, Tomar. Yeah? What would you I prefer? I clay. Tomar, Tomar, Tomar. What would you prefer? If, uh, your, your fingers all became tongues, or 20 years knocked off your life? Oh my gosh. I guess my fingers is tongues. Really? <laughs> 20 whole years? That's a lot. <laughs> I mean, is it really though? Because you know, you know, if you can live to 120, that just means you live to 100 now. I guess that's fair, but what if I was gonna live till 60, and it's like, oh, now I only have three years to live. Well, that Jeez. sounds like a you problem. But if you, but that means if you have 20 extra years, that means you have tongues for fingers. Oh, yeah, that, Tomar, that means if you wipe your ass, you're tasting your ass and everything. Wait, you never said I taste through the tongue. It's a tongue. Yeah, it's a tongue. It's a tongue. It's a tongue. It's a tongue. Tomar, I don't know. All right, I might have to rethink this. Tongue? Okay, Tomar. Those are both just bad. Tomar, you either can have the top of your head cut off and your brain is always exposed and you can never wear and a hat. And your hair is all tongues. Your hair is all tongues. <laughs> <laughs> and your, plus your brain is exposed. So and my exposed brain has tongues coming out Your exposed of it? brain is behind, like, a, a wall of tongues uh, going around your it's head. It's like a crown of tongues. <laughs> <laughs> Medusa tongues. I just, wanna, I just wanna make sure I have the right image in my head. And, too. You, and, yeah, and, and your toes and fingers are tongues. And your toes. And your skin and is, your trans balls, and your skin your is translucent. And your eyes are tongues. And your ass cheeks are a gorilla's chest. And your legs are horse legs. <laughs> <laughs> and your belly button is literally a dog's asshole. And your nose is a python, a yeah. snake, with venom. Yeah, how come the bad guys and the good guys both all hate the establishment? Or, I don't know what the plot is anymore. Yeah. Or, or, you're missing one dollar. You're missing one dollar from your Wells Fargo account. And you're double Jewish. What is even happening anymore? <laughs> So which one is it, Tomar? Which one is it, Tomar? Tomar, which one is it, Tomar? Which one is it, Tomar? Tomar, I, Tomar. I lost track a long time ago. You have to pick one, though. Can someone draw Tomar with the crown of tongues? And make they it look gonna, like- They were gonna do it already. Make it look like a religious, like, uh... Like a really ancient religious drawing. Make him holding his arms out, yeah. He's doing the, uh, the satanic pose. 
people lick his tongue for like a blessing. That they lick his cool. head tongue for their with their own. That's actually kind of a, a nice. Did we just idea. invent a new fucking religion? Tongue mar. <laughs> tongue mar. My God, it's tongue mar. I lick. I lick to the heavens every day <laughs> to pray. <laughs> Whenever it rains, I lick God's tears. There's too much fucking gasoline. There's too much gas in this video. Ooh. I love shitting, farting, and pooping. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I guess there's no fucking key in here. Is that the main mechanic of this game, is inflation? Mm-hmm. You don't like it? No, it's fine, I guess. What other games do that except for Kirby? No, that's true. Oh, well, yeah. That Mario is Kirby. Is. <laughs> Mario inflates. Mario inflates. Oh, I'm getting, my stomach is getting oh, big. Fuck. Oh, Luigi, whatever you do, don't look at my stomach. It's getting so much bigger this time. I cannot help but duck, brother. I love the one. Okay, Tomer, just get it out of the way. Make the fucking joke. Just say it. Hey, wait, make what joke? The zombies are like coronavirus. It. We get it, dude. Uh, we what know, we that? know, we know this is so much like quarantine right now because everything is going on, etc. with the virus. I was never going to make that joke. Why, <laughs> you, why are you dumping Tomar. that on me? You just by, that by, the way, by the way, no, it's not called the Wuhan virus. It's called COVID-19, dude. <laughs> I didn't say any of you this. You make some real corny jokes, but heck if we don't love them, huh? <laughs> he's oh lovable. God. That's what we love about him. He's why, lovable. Why are you he's, dumping he's, all he's this like... on me? <laughs> <laughs> it's lies. This is fabrication. Tomer's like Archie Bunker. He's a lovable guy. He's just got a little bit of learning to do. <laughs> oh, oh, oh it's like, <laughs> got him. I'm not the Archie Bunker of the group. I'm not wearing that title. Who's Archie Bunker? <laughs> oh, isn't he the guy from the the 1950s TV show that would be like, pow, straight to the moon? Oh, that yeah, guy. That's the guy. No, is it Archie Bunker from, uh, from, uh, 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 what's it called? The fucking sitcom The Family Get the Family Edge was ripped off of. It's from the All 70s. The, it was what? Uh, it was not, well, okay, whatever. I got the decade wrong. Yeah, you got, you're, th you're thinking of the honeymooners. Your dad was alive and peeing at the top of his lungs. You're thinking honeymooners instead of, that, that's, uh, that's, uh. Honey mustard. Uh, oh, that's. You're thinking a honey mustard packet. <laughs> Oh, I want this. You just read that on a honey mustard packet somewhere. That's what the fact the thing about Lyle, you guys all you gotta know is Lyle gets all of his quote unquote fun facts from honey mustard packets. He's still oh, they're Snapple stolen. lids, thank you very much, and they're very informative. Do you know that a rhino's horn is actually made of many strong tensiles of hair? Is and it it's a natural aphrodisiac, so you gotta hunt all the rhinos until they're extinct so you can get Yeah, grind it up and snort it, and only then will you become horny. Hey, baby, come back to my place and we'll talk about the Avengers some more. Yes, I could talk to you more about the structure of the second movie, which actually was adapted from another film. <laughs> Originally, I think it, I think it was going to be called Captain America 3 Days, so they made that Avengers 2. This and... is my hot take, but Age of Ultron wasn't as good as the first one. I just don't think it really held it a chance. It. it felt a little bit weak, and then, you, oh my god, you have number three, and it's even better than two, though. So it's <laughs> it, so it's very complicated at the end of it. Let me also say, I didn't really approve of the Hulk's character in Endgame. It just kind of ruined his arm. The glasses, I mean, come on! <laughs> <laughs> This guy's just, he's the coolest. He doesn't yes, talk about it yes. at all. Yeah, he's like, yeah. Like, fuck the Avengers. I don't even want to be there. Man, I here. hate the Avengers. They piss me off. I'm going to kill them when I grow up. Oh, boomer. Oh. Nice. I got the boom. There's a sweet bug out bag over here full of money and guns. Come on, Tomar. Say your joke. No. Say, <laughs> say come on. Joke? Say, come on. Okay, boomer. Let's just get it out. Get come it out on, of the Tomar. way. Do, 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 do the TikTok dance we know you love to do. <laughs> Keep dumping all these Whoa. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> that, that's Reggie Rocket. You can take a shortcut. You can take a shortcut. Go down. Get the get the C for. You coach. don't have to get the shortcut because the thing <laughs> becomes a shortcut. Corch cut. Corch cut. <laughs> I said I you was can trying take to a say. Chop. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to get the <laughs> checkpoint. You don't have to get the checkpoint before I, I like going to the secret. Chris has because his arms the secret in making these noises with a really stern expression. <laughs> <laughs> the secret becomes the checkpoint. How how hard can you do that voice? How, like how much can you strain your voice doing that? You can take a shortcut. <laughs> you can take a shortcut. <laughs> you guys are gonna be complaining about your throat hurting now. Yeah, my heart, that hurt. You can take a shortcut. <laughs> <laughs> you can take a shortcut. You can take a. <laughs> Don't die. You can take a bow. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I told you not to die. <laughs>
Little net boy want to fight. Chris, what would you do if uh, there's weed dough? You ch you you were you were here in the office and Matt was there and you said, "Oh, hey, Matt, come over here." And then as he walked over to you, the entire world started shrinking under your feet. How 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 long would it shrink for? How small uh, until would it, get? it was all gone, until it was just black. Why the fuck does Matt have to be brought into it? Because it's like he pulled you into the void. Does he shrink with it? No, no, he's like you two it's are just, the only. It, yeah, the it, entire <laughs> universe got pulled into the two of you. So and now you're really falling. what you're asking is what if you and Matt were trapped in a black area yeah, by you, ourselves? You got pulled into an infinite void with him. You're falling together forever. I don't know. I'd probably like weightlessly flip him upside down and start sucking him off. Okay, and he'd do the same for me. I hope. That's a good. It's good. Uh, Response. I take off my t-shirt and use like a parachute and it would look really cool. I don't think it would look cool. Look at those trees, they look so shitty. Look at the darkness. The final note! Did you know Coco was originally gonna be called Mexico when Disney tried to trademark Mexico? Yes, I knew that. Did you know? <laughs> you know what would have made Coco better? If the skeletons were just normal people. I can't relate to skeletons. Why didn't they make their eyes bigger? Why didn't they make the skeletons stupider? Why didn't they just make all the Mickey Mouse? Well, Land of the Dead, why didn't they just call it Land of the why Dead? Why didn't they call it Land Before Time? <laughs> <laughs> Instead of putting so much stupid colors in, why didn't they put in more humans? I just... They should have had an ar two armies fighting each other. <laughs> Okay, He's getting me invested, you know? Where were the orcs? Where were the oracles? Where was the prophets? <laughs> where, <laughs> where are the ancients? Even though the games are so simple and the graphics so primitive, it has a charm that will Chris, never be matched. Chris, can we go back to- we, we all- we wanted to just get food right now. We thought of an update on, oh, the, yeah, on yeah, the hypothetical. Yeah. Do you want to say it, Chris? Do you want to propose? Well, I was asking our other friend at dinner, Jack, about the same hypothetical to see what he would say. Which, and then, by, by the way, just to refresh the hypothetical. The hypothetical was, if you had a supercomputer that could definitely 100% like accurately tell you that there's a certain list of people out in the world that want to kill you if they run into you. Uh, so, so just to be clear, the computer is a it is accurate, there's no trick. It knows these people want to kill you, and it's given you a list, and right? It would, and they would kill you if, if, if they, they ran into you. If they ran into you. So the hypothetical was, if you were out in a gas station bathroom, and the, one of the killers walked up next to you, started pissing, and didn't re they didn't see you yet, but they slipped and, and passed out on the ground, and you got to kidnap them and, and bring them, them up, and you tie them up and, and bring them, them back to a cabin. Well, no, wait, cabin. okay, just let let's take the <laughs> let's take that out of the equation. No, but that that was what Zach was getting to. That was that was what he, I was. He, was, he found a way to fix it and make it better. <laughs> Which was just why I because I when you were asking it initially I thought you were gonna ask the guy slips and hits his head, and it's like it's like a Breaking Bad like like Walter White Jane thing where it's like do you do you like tip his head away from the pee and let him drown in pee or do you let him live? <laughs> but then you said you like have a, like a you cut his hands and feet off with a knife, then take him back to your cabin. Okay, the yeah. question is no longer what would you do. The question is how do we fix this hypothetical? You know what we're well, going I for. I still think my hypothetical works slightly better because Lal, you you also said that uh, if they're just gonna die on their own, then that's not really a moral question on you. Really? Right. You, you're, you're saving a murderer? Like, you probably still would do that, but you wouldn't because you know they're gonna kill. Yeah. Exactly. But, but so it, need, it needs to be a scenario where you we, have to actively kill them or you can leave them be. No, no, and no, you'll be or, fine. Just, or just, they're gonna die, do you save them? No, I wouldn't say that. I feel like that's exactly. too easy. Yeah, it's too but, easy. But, but, but is it though? Okay, okay, fine, 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 fine. They're laying there unconscious, but you can tilt their head and they choke on the pee like Jane. Like exactly <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like See, that's better. So you can kill them, but it's just tilting their head to the left. You're not like strangling yeah, or anything. Yeah, honestly, I don't know why I included the whole cabin part. You could just do this all in the bathroom and leave. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, th I think you're, yeah, we, we need to decomplicate this scenario. I, I guess so I was being you... slightly more realistic because if you did it in the bathroom, you get caught on security or get seen or so something. So would you tilt his head and make him choke on the pee? Um, like there's pee in his mouth, but then he's like laying on the side. But if you tilt his head all back, all and then see, he, if so, if, see, if this it, is her jumping on the pee. What the fuck was <laughs> happening? Whoa, that, that does look kind of cool, honestly. It does look kind of like my pee. Yeah, this is this is the last thing that they'll see before you drown them in pee. If you uh... see, I still don't know if I would or not. 
You I'd, wouldn't turn their head and drown them in pee? I'd feel too bad, but then also, as soon as I leave, I'd be, like, regretting it. I'd be like, God damn it, that guy's still out there, he's gonna kill me. He's a murderer. But then if I did it, I'd be like, what the hell? How am I supposed to know if the, if the AI was lying or not? Oh. I, I, that's, I, mean, that's, I, that's I think that's the biggest problem with the hypothetical is you said that the guy isn't lying, <laughs> but how do we know that? He could have been lying to you to, to trick you into killing. I, I don't know. You just okay, okay, you have I, to really trust it. I don't know. Okay, what what if instead of because this is also the problem if if you know a guy will kill you hypothetically. Okay, let, let's ch let's change it from a computer then. Let's say let's say you meet this guy and he kills you and then you wake up like. Five years earlier, yeah. uh, and so you know it's gonna happen. It's like you 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 live the exact same yes, day. Would, then I you would, definitely yes. would. Then you definitely would. Or or what if you know he killed somebody else already? Let's say let's say. Well, there no, was th then he's then he's already killing, and you know he's gonna kill you. Now no, he's no, like no no no. I'm saying you you don't know he's gonna kill you. Let's say he like tr like cut cut old one's face off and like made a nice <laughs> apple pie of it and like did a little jig and dance. Then like, I would. He then, danced yeah. like he danced like Pennywise on her Ooh, dead body. You're good. Thank you. And then, uh, <laughs> and then, so, so he's definitely already done it. He's like the old lady. That still makes it too easy. He's the old you lady hatchet then. killer. Okay, how about this? What if, uh, you accidentally hacked his cool email and, uh, he was sending emails to himself saying, I'm definitely gonna do it. I'm going to kill Zach Hadel. Uh, was there anything else in the emails that was of interest? Pictures of you with knives photoshopped in your heart and head. And he definitely made it? Uh, yeah, he signed it. So his Hotmail account has me dead on it. Yeah. But then again, he might just be a <laughs> who's just like taking it out on you, just be like, joking. healthily as a joke. <laughs> okay, but okay, okay, I-, I Yeah, just, like I'm when you talk about fucking Kevin, Kevin Smith's chest, that's not a I real- would, <laughs> which, which I would, by the way, which, which I think is what that's gave him the- That's not a joke, I would do that. I would do that, and I think that it's what gave him the panic attack, by the way. I think you're right. So Chris, let's say same thing to you. Yeah. You hack his email, and there's 99 pictures of him photoshopping like a big, uh, uh, fire in the sky, needle into your eye. <laughs> Guys, I got a way to fix the hypothetical. What's- how do you fix it? You're out in your backyard, you're drinking Diet Fanta. <laughs> right, you look up, you see a green flash. A big meteor crashes in your backyard, killing your dog. And, uh, inside of the meteor is this- is this computer, right? You're like, hmm, and you bring it in, you put it on your kitchen table, and now, you turn on the computer, and you see you in real time, right? And now you I can would put, immediately close it at that moment. No, you in real time, and then you put your hand on the mouse, and you can like you can scroll around and look around you in real time from different angles. You can zoom out into the world and fly around and look at things I going on. I assume I got fucking crazy already <laughs> by this point. I assume I'm like dying or like in a like a daydream. No, but you're able to fly around the world in real time. You're able to go anywhere. You can type in France. Now you're in France, looking around. What's going on? You could say rewind by. Hmm. 10 seconds, and you can see what happened 10 seconds ago. Go into the future, 10 seconds, and then you can see 10 seconds of the future, right? This thing is confirmed that it is absolutely accurate, and, uh, there's no reason to believe it's not. So it's like the computer from that show. By, yeah, uh, by, the uh, show Pewter, right. <laughs> yeah, pew yeah, Pewter. Pewter. <laughs> Pewter. But, uh, yeah, you, you, you can ask it anything, and it always gets it right. You're like, what is 2 plus 2? It's like 4.1. You, you have a god you're like, oh computer. my god, that's amazing. You have a god computer. Yes. You got the god computer from the aliens and it works. So now you're like, you can ask it anything and you could say, does anyone out there want to kill me? And it's like, here is 42 people that definitely would kill you if given the chance. And, and what do I do? See, so what do I do with that knowledge? And you're, you're, like, what, you're like, what's the closest one? It's like, there is one 30 meters walking outside with their dog. <laughs> yeah. and you're like, oh my god! See, in this scenario, I'd assume the aliens want me to kill my neighbor and, like, lock me away. No, oh. but, but you, you've had this computer for, like, let's say you've had it for 20 years now, and, and then you decide to ask you that question. And it's been accurate every time. It's been accurate for 20 fucking years. You've won millions of dollars with the lottery. You can trust this thing. Would I? No, because the person's walking their dog. If I run out to them, and now they slip on pee, bring back the pee. I think we're almost there. This is like one of those puzzles <laughs> where you're just like trying to. F <laughs> I I feel like it's it's very clear what we're trying to ask. Yes. And we just want you to think about it. Yes. Wait, Chris. Yes. You're outside drinking diet fanta. <laughs> uh, you're wipes wearing, chin. Yeah. You, you wipe your chin. You wipe the orange side. Your hand is stained forever. And you're 100 years old. That orange stain is still there. But okay. You're looking up at the stars cross-eyed. Uh huh. And uh. You see a big green flash, just like in your scenario. Wow. And you get dematerialized and brought into the <laughs> into the orb. Ah! 
Ah. And you wake up and aliens start dissecting you and like stabbing you with a million oh tools and they start god. pointing and laughing oh at you. Oh my god. And this they like is they like open your mouth up and they like pull your tongue and like start stabbing you with a big pen. <laughs> And uh, <laughs> then one starts jerking you off and sucking you up. <laughs> and, you, and, you look down, and you look down, and it feels better than any woman has ever felt in your whole life. Good and aliens. literally, you go cross on like Dead Accurate and Ghostbusters, <laughs> and you shoot the biggest fucking load ever. But as you're getting sucked up, the aliens are going, ah, like one alien's like stabbing you in the chest with a pen all over <laughs> you. And you're stab ripping your intestines open, like put, putting it back in, ripping, put, taking it out, putting it back in. Stop. And once, so you're experiencing the worst, <laughs> the worst pain. Yeah, and pleasure. And pleasure at the same time. Once like dissecting your brain and one's pr like <laughs> figuring your prostate. Okay. And then and then one kicks you the balls and then one kisses you and says I love you I love you. Right. And then they deep they rematerialize you and put you back on Earth. <laughs> and you're cross-eyed again. Uh. It's been like one second, but it definitely really happened. Yeah. And you see the orange. You see the orb. Well, get to off. the hypothetical. <laughs> What would you do in that scenario? <laughs> it's over! <laughs> it happened! Would you ever get over that though? Or you, you, I don't know, I don't know how, how that works. But wouldn't you, like every time you tried to jack up or like have sex with a woman, you'd be limp because you'd just be thinking about the alien. Oh, I'd be like, nothing can relate to every, how good that every, was. You'd be closing your eyes, thinking about the alien, like suck you up. And it got me addicted to like, uh, like self-harm. You'd self yeah, you'd yeah. be like, you could only get up if an alien was sucking your dick while you could I would just like, I would keep going out into the desert and like shining lights up at the sky, Hoping they'd come back down and get me. You again. could also never tell anybody about that. Nobody could ever relate to you. I'm why, sure there's people on the internet tell that people, would. But I think you could you could tell anyone you want about I that. Mean, I, yeah, I, I could be like Zach. You tell your parents. They wouldn't believe me. What, what do you? What would you think? What do you think your real parents would say if, if you told my them? My real parents. <laughs> if you told them that. As opposed to you know, my not these other, other fake ones that you keep bringing around. To say, to yeah, fool besides us. your fake. Uh, my parents, real Brazilian parents. You, the ones you hired on Fiverr to, to walk around your house and like cradle you and lift you up. Yeah. Put you on their shoulder and spank you? Uh, I would tell my mom, and she would be like... She- she would- she literally would just be like... I just- no. That's just, nice, dear. No, she, she- she would just be like, oh, would you ever cop on? Would you, you ever stop? What, what if you were dead serious and you really meant it? She wouldn't believe me, but she'd probably just try to be nice. <laughs> she'd be supportive, roughly? I think? I, she would just be like... She would just think I'm crazy, she'd be like, uh, oh, he's... He's talking about the aliens again. <laughs> so he's talking about the aliens ripping his guts out and sucking him off again. And I don't blame her. That's what yeah. I would do to my annoying son who said he saw aliens. Oh, is this where you pick your Pokemon? I think Ew. it is. Flopper, there you are. I needed to ask you a favor. I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. That's yeah, for sure. That's made his up. name. Yeah. Made up. I hate all these Pokemon obsessed weirdos. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that he's the this Joseph Mandela of the Pokemon <laughs> world. <laughs> this time it's real. I didn't put it in. <laughs> it is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Who the research. fuck is Joseph Mangala? You're gonna have to run that. Oh, by he's me. A, just a little bit of a troll. Let's he's just a, say. No, he's a he's a famous, troll. An infamous, I should say, German doctor who is known for. <laughs> Tomo, you're bringing the mood down, man. We're just trying to play Pokemon. <laughs> I just want to see I'm a just Pikachu, to brother. To Corey, <laughs> oh, he's the one who turned Hitler into a mech in Wolfenstein. I know what you're talking about. He's the one Get sure. the, do the deer legs. Okay, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> I can jump 25 feet in the air! But Tomer's head was grafted to his head by that guy. My Who? head was grafted to my head? Your head was grafted my to your head. <laughs> I've done the most evil experiment <laughs> ever! I've grafted his head to his body! Tomer was just the body before that. So, uh... Once again, we have to make this fucking disclaimer, but everyone was being mean to us in the comments again, <sighs> and, uh... We're kinda getting cr we're kinda getting crummy over it. If you guys could stop <laughs> leaving comments that are in any well, form, way, shape, negative. I know people like to think of us as, you know, mascots, as these funny guys. We're real people. And I'll tell you something. <laughs> our, 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 buddy, our buddy Lyle here was bedridden. Bedridden for a week after he read through those damn comments. So remember every time you every time you write a troll comment or a hateful comment or any, any garbage like that, there's a real person with real eyeballs processing every fucking thing you write. So just a heads up. You with that hire one. a care or with a, a long I'm actually, spoon. I'm actually on the uh, other end of this. Lyle was in hospice care because he was so fucking depressed. No, he had I want to die. Fucking he, he had comment somebody me take to death. Fucking bring it on. Lyle, Lyle had Lyle had a, a nurse by his bedside, uh, dampening his mouth off with a wet cloth because he was so <laughs> de debilitated from the depression <laughs> and the anxiety. Hey. Oh no! Oh, help! Get, get, get off of me, man! I'm oh, sorry, shot you. 
Yes, comment. I shot him. I did it mm. again too. Okay, I Oops, saw I it. You would do it again. <laughs> Like Britney, dude. Daddy, no! This, guy, this guy's got long ass legs, dude. I'm gonna swing on his feet! He's clipping through the roof like Robin Williams and Jumanji. <laughs> Does that happen? Yeah, yeah, and then he ended up like Robin Williams oh, yeah, in he's real like, life. Oh, uh, I was waiting for somebody. Oh my god! Oh my god, delete that! Yeah, I didn't I was, mean it like that. I was waiting for Chris to do a lot of fucking things. I was on edge. I was like, what oh my gonna, god. What is what are we gonna say? No, it's, it's when he. Because that really is what happened. Yeah! In Jumanji, he starts sinking like quicksand. No, <laughs> holy fuck! Look, there's a shit like this. <laughs> <laughs> Completely just. Oh my god! Look, it's Biko. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that was his bike. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good impression. Well done. Oh, he's wearing an apron. It's old lady steals mail. Oh, it's <laughs> <laughs> steals mail. Back at it again. I see. <laughs> old lady reads mail. <laughs> Are they this twins? Is not mine. <laughs> <laughs> She's not mine. <laughs> nice, that's a nice oh, blue t-shirt. My mail. <laughs> <laughs> it's being stolen. But why? You guys. It's old man green cloak. Why is everybody old? <laughs> I don't know why. It's four years later. It's like a common trope that I always used to see. It's like old man Sherman lives on old old, old man river. <laughs> lives on old man old man Green's lives on old man hill. <laughs> <laughs> and all the other old men. <laughs> old man Peabody. And then in Crash Bandicoot three, they they named all the scientist enemies in the code fucker and motherfucker. Did they really? Yeah. <laughs> so th those are their official names. <laughs> I know all about the fucker and motherfucker and Willie. <laughs> Ask me about the fucker. And Willie. <laughs> Ask me about the fucker from Crash Bandicoot. I could tell you all about him. Dude, I did it. Good job. Now we're gonna find out there's, there was a secret entrance. Just you wait. I bet it's on this guy. You found it. What? Oh my god. <laughs> what? No! We just lost all the- Whoa! No! You- Ah! How was I supposed to know? Why did you make that joke? <laughs> <laughs> Let's all three tell a story with one word each. Okay, that's a good excursion. Let's, no, let's write the su the plot to the new su with Sonic, Sonic movie Picture three. 3. Yeah, Sonic Movie 3? Movie 3. There is a black man. Uh. Oh, I was gonna say I'll walk in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'll walk in. Yeah. There's uh, a black man a walk in. <laughs> Corey. Stumbling. Kama, okay, Kama stumbling. Okay, through. Uh. The uh, forest of the illusion. Uh, people think. What? Wait, what? <laughs> Wait. Wait, okay, let's start that one over. Okay. The new plot to the Sonic movie. <laughs> Sonic. Think. Okay, new, new Sonic movie. Sonic. Sonic is running when his shoes begin to tear and rip. His Fuck. cock <laughs> causing his ass to dilate, <laughs> which wait, 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 which Chris uh begins to make Sonic squirt <laughs> strings of. <laughs> uh, Bile. <laughs> Strings of bile. <laughs> That's so disgusting. <laughs> so rancid. <laughs> so he's on his running, his shoes rip. It, it makes his, it makes, his ass tiny. His, his, his ass tears and makes his shoe bile. <laughs> All right, that's Sonic Movie 3, guys. Paramount, what? if you want it, we're open to negotiations. That's just the first, just the first you part. Can buy, you can buy a script. There's three, a three-act structure. You're right. That's Act 1. <laughs> All right, that's bookended. Then, okay, so now, now this is part, this is the middle of, okay. Oh, fuck, Tomer's calling. What? Are you doing my, are you going to Hello? Your Hello? Let's do, let's do the three-act structure. Oh, yeah, Sonic, Sonic Movie 3, Part 2, okay, so let's part one, two. Part, word by word again. Okay, I'll start. Okay. okay. Eggman comes. No, 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 wait, we're going that way? Okay. Sorry, Eggman comes... Uh, inside... A... Egg... And... 
Eggman, Eggman comes inside an egg and uh, moans <laughs> incessantly. Don't go near the edge. Period. Uh, <laughs> uh, moans incessantly. That's Act Two. What? <laughs> comes inside an egg. It moans incessantly. Hey, what's what is incessantly? incessantly loudly? Okay. Oh, Corey! Corey, please. Okay, now Act Three. So part oh, one was that Sonic. Fuck. Sonic ran so fast his shoes oh, ripped off. How scared are you? Stay <laughs> away from the edge! Oh my god. Sonic eats bile or something? Yeah, it spits bile, yeah. Okay, <laughs> then Duck Pig Man came inside an egg. Okay. And now Act 3. You start, Zach. Okay. Uh, we need to include Shadow. Knuckles. Okay, Shadow. Corey, it's you. Shadow. Blows. Amy. <laughs> up. <laughs> Using. His. <laughs> TNT. <laughs> That's, no, no, not TNT. No, no, no. Uh. Uh, I mean, it worked. Look, he's blowing roadside up. Roadside bomb. <laughs> that's, that's a hyphen. Words. That's a hyphen. Roadside bomb. Yeah. Causing, I I E D. Causing a <laughs> crater. <laughs> Causing a crater. And a massive. I massive. <laughs> massive what? Dog. That's the Dog? point. Eight. The cutscene. Alright, that's Act Three. <laughs> Shadow Shadow blew up Amy with an IED, a roadside bomb, and, and, a, dog, a, and a dog ate a cutscene. <laughs> well, that's that's Sonic Movie Three, guys. So let's Turn recap. If you want to fucking let's negotiate, recap. you have it. Here's the email on the screen. <laughs> now, what did you say your name was? Oh, oh, I know what you should you call him. It could be new name, uh, and it's going to be. You get Epstein. seven characters. Yeah, that's right, Farquad. <laughs> Fab. Fabulous! Faber? Faber? Fabers. Fabers. I don't want to be Fabers. What about- That just- that's just based <laughs> off our, the artist- <laughs> FUCK! <No! laughs> we can't use any of that, god damn it! You have to restore it, motherfucker! The fucking editors get the bleep out of the name of every fucking- You can absolutely do it! You can rewind rewind the emulator! emulator. Right. Really I think you can rewind the this emulator! This has just become a win! Wow. <laughs> I didn't right, mean to hit right, right the precious. Oh, you didn't mean to hit Ed. You just held the button you down and put the down the precious first. world. Yeah, <laughs> didn't mean the to. precious world of Pokemon. Rewind. Look, rewind. Where? 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 It's literally under config. Yeah, you gotta go to the hotkey configuration. Chris, you really fucked up. I literally didn't fucking mean. No, 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 no it's fine, but you really Shift fucked up. R. Shift Genuinely, R. Genuinely, probably the f the fucking most epic opening to a Pokemon oh. game ever. <laughs> Here we go. Magic's oh, happening. Oh, I'm so right. happy. I'm All so right. happy. All right. All right, now let- Nothing okay. happens. Okay. Get, go to another letter. <laughs> yeah. I wish I was Robert Cobb. Yeah, Don't I wish I was off. a little bit taller, you know what I mean? I wish I was made of silver. I yeah. wish I had my face wrapped around a big metal skull. Yeah. I wish I could stomp around like don't don't. Oh, I yeah. don't have engineering yeah, level six, yeah. I suppose. I wish I could throw a tantrum whenever I want, and <laughs> no one could stop me. His stomps sound cool because it sounds like there's like. Uh, I wish somebody could shoot me in the arm and blow my arm, my hand oh, off, and I... say nah, 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 and then they should shoot me in the head. Yeah, yeah. I'm not a good enough to do so. I wish off. Robocop was my upstairs neighbor. <laughs> that would be <laughs> annoying. <laughs> Circles all day. <laughs> But you'd know he was being cool up there. I'd be like, alright. He would just like collapse through the roof. All <laughs> and the then you get to hang out with him. <laughs> well, He'd crash onto your couch on. next to you and then. I don't know how to get back up. Now yeah, that I'm here, but... we might as well have a fun time. Yeah, right. it'd be like it'd be like a Super Bowl kiss. Doritos commercial where it's like Robocop crashes through the guy's ceiling. Yo, dude, Robocop coming in to hang out with me? Alright. <laughs> First one to not say Bobo Bop loses. Bobo Bop. I win. I lose. I win. I lose. <laughs> Loser <laughs> has to die. No! <laughs> 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 we should play that game sometime. Bobo Bob first one to say Bobo Bob loses. <laughs> oh, wait, first one not to say Bobo Bob. Yeah, I'm confused. Yo, wait, what's the I game? The Yo, wait, what is the game? I thought it was to say. I don't even know what the rule is. I thought it was not to say. It. The first one not to say Bobo Bob. The first one not to say Bobo Bob doesn't lose. Oh, that's so confusing. Doesn't win because they lose because they're not winning. It's time to do business with the Jizznas. <laughs> he took the word right out of my mouth. The Jizznas? That's our, that's our guest.
<laughs> Welcome to Jesus. Welcome to Jesus. I'm the Jesus. How are you doing today, man? I'm doing the Jesus. <laughs> How are you doing today, the Jesus? Uh, I'm been talking a little bit. Been doing the Jesus. Well, have you done? Anything? Have you like you know jizzed anything up today? Have you done anything? I jizzed up a glob. <laughs> Jizzed up a glob. Jizzed up a little glob. Uh, how, uh, how big was that? Oh, glob. Yeah, about yay big. Oh my god! Wow. That's bigger yeah. than a snake. That's bigger than a, a corn coiled snake. up snake. Corn. I, I could That's do a bigger, bigger than a coiled up corn snake. I don't jizz in a little bit. I do a, a bigger glob, but I can't. Right, respect, man. I, I is, just can't help tr- myself. Is it true that clinics are willing to pay it well within the six figure range for, for just one of your globs? This. I, I, I look. It's a it's a rumor you're gonna online. Ask a man about his gloves. You're gonna you're gonna ask a man about his gloves. I, um, I'm with you, man. You don't have to answer, but the pe- the fans at home would love to, to know. I would prefer not to. Oh. All right. I did. But by the way, just let it be that I didn't. I'm not the one who asked it. I'm not gonna apologize for let asking a question. That. I don't think you should. I'm, can the, you guys this get him to done. leave? This is, Chris, I'm sorry. <laughs> just ask me before you bring weirdos. Sorry. Yo, is that the jizzness? Yeah, he just left. Fuck. I wanted his autograph. Dude, I think he took your keys. I just think I think he took your car keys. Mine? The ones that were on yeah. the table right here? Yeah. I got a spare. Thanks, man. Jesus Christ. I mean, it doesn't matter if he took your car, but... I think he's taking your car, is what I'm saying. He took the whole <laughs> keys. He took, dude, he took your gym shit, all everything attached to your car keys. I got two it. cars. It's okay. Well... What, which I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay with it if Chris is okay with it. The business is stealing whoever's car. That's... Yeah, you know, I mean, like well, you, we let celebrities get away with it. I kind of like being around every him. with anything. Yeah, right? it's like a brand deal. It's like we're giving him a brand deal for yeah, a car. Yeah, it's like yeah, you get Chris's car. because yeah. you get to come on the channel. Is that cool, Chris? That's what I don't care. <laughs> Damn, dude. Oh. Chris has really been cold toward the business this entire visit. It was sociopathic, dude. <laughs> probably why he left give me yeah that. it was chris that offended him right yeah yeah I kind he, of was figured he, was literally, he was literally just hanging out until chris you know i don't feel bad you didn't I'm... ask if he was paid for his globs did you chris no you asked him that i didn't i wasn't here well, i wasn't here chris. oh yeah tomar asked i don't him remember that. i don't really remember who asked him tomar that. wouldn't have asked him tomar. that who's banging that bell it's driving me up the fucking wall what if he raised his eyebrows up and down, but then fucked the bear instead of riding it? Yeah. Remember when Homer dressed up as Panda Bear and he got raped in Panda Hall? You missed the ball! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Where'd his body go? Look at that. Crash! Lyle, when you die, I promise we will bury you with all your Highlanders uh, amiibos. My high, high, Skylanders. 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 Damn it! <laughs> Highlander. Cut it out! No, keep it in. Cut out the joke. Stonehenge! Stonehenge, yes! 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 Yeah, I like this. Yeah, 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 bug! There's a big okay, bug in there. Okay, this is it. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> of course! <laughs> okay. <laughs> he went, Get the hell, quick! Yeah! <laughs> he went, <laughs> I want to be the best there ever was. Beat all the ref, yeah, that's my car. Electro Diglett, Nino. I was Maggie, about to say. <laughs> Venusaur, Ratata, Fero, Pidgey, Seeking, Jolteon, Dragonite, Ghastly, Ponyta, Vaporeon, shit, I can't do that. Ponyta, Vaporeon, Polyrath, Butterfree. Catch him, catch him, gotta catch him all. Pokemon. Pokemon! I'll search across the. Oh, well, I'll search across. Why does it say I don't like know that? what you're doing. I'll search. Oh, I'll search across the land. Look far oh. and wide. Released from my hand. The the that's inside. Venomoth, Poliwag, Nidorino, Golduck, Ivysaur, Grimer, Victory Bell, Moltres, Nido King, Farfetch'd, Moltres Abra, doesn't Jigglypuff. rhyme with slow Kingler? dogs. Then. What the fuck is Kingler? I don't remember that one. Kingler evolves from Krabby. Yeah. Oh, it's Kingler, stupid. Rhyhorn, Clefable, Wigglytuff. Ka-chung, ka-chung, ka-chung. Hey, he didn't do it right. He says Wigglytuff. 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 <laughs> <laughs> he goes, whoa. Wigglytuff. Oh. Catch him, catch Look at that one! Ew! Pokemon! Zoomat, Prime. Check out those yeah, lips, now. There's, there's no Zoomat. <laughs> Zoomat, Primate, Meowth, Onyx, Geodude, Rapidash, Megaton. You're fucking Onyx. it up! That's how he says it! Let Tango, him do it. Tingala, Goldeen, Spiro. You say Dingo, Tingalo? Wazing Shield, Garda, Slow Bro. I remember that part. Katum, katum, gotta cut them. Fool. fool. Kabuto, Persian, Paras, Horsey. Panuto. Kabuto. Panunto. Naruto. Panetta. 
Oh, my nose. So <laughs> itchy. Are you okay? <laughs> Is your no nose bleeding, Chris? Horsey. Radicate, mag magnemite, cadabra. There's no minion. Weeping bell. Minion might. <laughs> Ditto, cloister, caterpie, sand shrew, bulbasaur, charmander, golem, Pikachu. 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 At least 150 or more to see. The Pikachu master is my dance to tree. <laughs> Just keep going. Don't, don't even care. Like... I like his M to do O, Vanilla and Mighty Show. Skibbly diddly diddly do. <laughs> Genghis got Hypno Electabuzz Gen Flareon. <laughs> <laughs> Kangas it's, not, it's Kangas Khan, not Genghis Khan. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Kazakhstan Hypno Electabuzz Flareon. Blastoise Pearly Royal. Audish Drowsy. Rachel Queen Bell Sprout Starby. Queen Sprout Starby. Uh. And he says, Woo! We're at the halfway point. Oh my god, there's more. Shake out those lips. <laughs> Now listen real good. Wait, wait, wait uh, uh, break time's over. Home. Here we go. Metapod, Marowak, Catacomb, Kakuna, Clefairy, Dodrio, Sidra, Vellaplume, Krabby. <laughs> Leave him alone. I like this. Let him Rain go. Lickitung, Tauros, Weedle, Nidoran, Machope, Shelter, Porygon, Hitmonchan. Today. Katum, Katum, Gotta cut them all. Julie. Shake your mama. Articun, Articuno Jinx. That is he fucking. It's not Chicken Mama, it's Sugar Artu Mama. I said Sugar Articuno Mama. Articuno Jinx, said chicken Nidorina mama. Beedrill, Haunter, Squirtle, Chansey, oh, look at the Ewok. Pokemon. What? It just fills it in with Pokemon? It, it just fills this in with Pokemon. It goes Articuno Jinx, Nidorina Beedrill, Haunter, Squirtle. No, no, listen! It's listen it's what, what it, it does! Goes, Pokemon! Yeah. It goes Haunter, Squirty Chansey. Oh, Squirty Chan. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, I'm gonna I don't remember Paris sect. Is that the evolution of Paris? The yeah. evolution. Execute mock Dogong. Do Pidgeotto Lapras Vulpix right on. You said mock. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> At least 150 or more to see to be a Pokemon master is my destiny. Destiny. Charizard, so Machop, Pinsir, Coughing, <laughs> Dugtrio, Golbat, Star, You, Magikarp, Nine Tails, Atkins, Oh my star. Oh, yeah, oh my star. Scyther, Tentacle, Dragonar, Magmar. And he says, Whoa, catch your lips, breath man, shake those lips. <laughs> it's downhill from here, only 20 more to go. It is downhill from here. <laughs> Sand Slash, Hitmolly, Psyduck, Arcanine, Eevee, Egg, Egg, Eggplant, <laughs> Kabutops, Zapdos, uh, Flower, Dratini, uh, Gorelith, Mime, Milk, <laughs> Cubone, Graveler, Voltar, Does Gloom, eggs. We're almost, almost home! Catch em, catch em, gotta catch em all. Pokemon. Then he says, Chameleon, Wartortle, Mewtwo, Kentacool, Arc- No, you fucked up! <laughs> it's just Wartortle! Okay, Char- Oh, so it's- Charmeleon! Wartortle! Mewtwo, Tentacool, Aerodactyl, Omen Knight, Slowpoke, Pidgey, Yacht, Arbuck- That's all, folks! And he said- Then he goes- That's all, folks! Tay's on day. That's little Tay. Look, he was kicking ass at that age, look at that. Is he making this up as he goes along? Dude, no, dude. If he were, that'd be pretty amazing, but I don't think so. Is that like a Jehovah's Witnesses thing that they think they <laughs> they think or, they die and go to Christmas planets? I I don't they know. They get they get a planet for every holiday they don't that, celebrate. That's my ignorance of, of <laughs> obscure like like cult like religious offshoots. I am orange and I step away. He's orange. <laughs> he is orange in that video. Go he's to Chocolate Rain. Look how orange he is. Look, he's pure orange. Yeah, he is. Oh yeah, <laughs> he's very he's orange. really brightly lit. And it's also amazing when the camera cuts to his hands and you realize that he's a fucking prodigy on the keyboard. Wait, are he's you, playing. Are you that. serious? He's yeah. playing. When, when it cuts to his hands, you won't believe your eyes. <laughs> Chocolate rain. I don't believe you. No, I swear on my freaking soul. His arms are moving. I know. Yes, they are. Yes, I they know. Are. Yes, they are. It's insanity. You're lying. No, it's a, I'm not. It's a I'm trick not. cutaway. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. It's a trick cutaway. It's not. No, it's not. Hey, hey, not. Look. I freaking told okay, you. Okay, but it's not from. It's a. It's a separately <laughs> recorded no, thing. Uh, nope. <laughs> He's seated there. <laughs> that's the second kid. He's, he's, up, he's hanging from the fucking ceiling upside down. <laughs> yeah, Tomo, you like look, you're looking at him right side up. He's like GLaDOS for Portal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's just integrated with, the, with this computer and he's just hanging out of it. Right, he's just a torso. I'm watching Tay Sunday for heaven's sake. Okay.
This is probably a stupid ass question, but do Greek people still believe in these gods and shit? No. <laughs> Why not? Because they made a helicopter and they went to the top of it and they were like, there's nothing here. <laughs> there, I created a little rift now each oh, time Mount I Olympus? dash. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot that's, that's a real what, thing. <laughs> that's kind of what happens when you tie your religion to a physical place that you can actually get to the top of. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, the Japanese had that going against them too, that their emperor was like supposed to be like Ugh. some agent of God, and then he went on the radio and said he wasn't, because they Cause lost World War II. They got II. bombed by Hiro. Yeah. Wait, Hirosaki. Ganucci. Wait, that's, that's false. Guys, I'm just gonna say it. We bombed them, okay? The Irish? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> County Wexford bombed Nanasaki and Hiroshima. I fucking knew it. It was purely because we were afraid of what we didn't understand. Yeah, you guys need to stop doing that. We did. We haven't done it since. That's fair. But I see you thinking about it. I do rub my chin and ponder it a lot. <laughs> what if we do it again? This time... We've learned from our mistakes. Okay, what would you do if you were in the middle of the woods? Yep. And, Walking uh, around. Walking around. And you saw <laughs> dead oh, in the middle of the that. woods. <laughs> would you tell anybody? Why would you say that? Sorry, you just brought- I forgot you actually- sorry, you cut that out. I forgot you know him- oh, sorry. He's a, he's a still obscure- I don't like, think he'd mind if he's you an said that. He's an entity in my mind now, he's not a person- I'm sorry, I forgot. <laughs> You just brought <laughs> that out of him decomposing in the woods like a body like, like, a, like a body farm. Sag. What would you do if, if you were in the middle of the woods? And? You saw... Lyle. You saw Lyle, your friend, on a in a body farm decomposing in the middle of the woods. <laughs> <laughs> and his face was bloated and purple. And it wasn't funny, it was actually the scariest shit you'd ever seen in your life. And it was like his eyes were bugged out like a horror movie. Yeah, uh, what and would I do? I would just- I, I would instantly <laughs> call people, be like, when was the last time you saw Lyle? And they say, he's sitting right next to me. And I'd be like, oh, there's this guy- I, I just stumbled into a body farm and there's a, a fucking bloated corpse that looks just like Lyle here. What- then what if- what if you turned around and he stood up and he was like- and he started like walking at you? Um, I'd just run. I wouldn't want to get touched by it. You wouldn't want him to come and, like, record with us? Bloated corpse Lyle? Okay, Lyle, different scenario. If you saw yourself on a body farm, and it was definitely you, same, like, perfect penis, uh, same, <laughs> same, same, like, tattoos, like, it was you, it was undeniably you, same about everything. Oh. What would you do? I'd bring it home and live with it. You, like, drag it home no, you in the wouldn't. back of your it smell horrible. What are you talking about? No, it's alive. He's, what, does it stand up still in my scenario? It's uh, a corpse! Okay, yeah, in this case, it's just a corpse. You just, would you, what, what, would you, would you take it home with you still? I would probably, you could like... make it like a coffee table or something. I could, yeah. I yeah, would not I, do I, that. I would get, like, a big tube of formaldehyde and, like, put it in there. You'd pickle and then it him. kills it. Yeah, well, I, it, it, it's be, already dead, that'd but... Be, that'd be Pickle Lyle in real life. It'd be like, like, you know Goku when he's, like, healing in the fucking tube? Yeah, the cryogenic chamber. Yeah, I'd make, I'd make it look like that and just put it in my living room and then people would walk in. And relax. What, if, what if then people were like, which one do I shoot? It, but people kept like, you know, it's in your house and it's like... Oh, people like start talking to that one, you're like, I'm over here. And it's like, um, it looks nothing like you, but people still confuse you too, just because it has that effect to it. What's well, in I mean? a big tube of formaldehyde, I don't think it... Well, that's what you sleep in sometimes, the big formaldehyde tube. You're Joe Rogan. Yeah, but I don't let people watch me sleep, Sorry, so should... they know that that's abnormal. And by the way, you could bleep that out. I don't want to, I don't want to reveal your formaldehyde. Okay, guys, No, wait, you, wait. Could, you could leave the formaldehyde. Guys, 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 yeah. guys, guys. It's time I face the music on Hello? that one. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> You're making him quadruple moonwalk. I don't think that's what that is. What do you booga, mean? Booga. Uh, Julian, no racism on this channel. Uh, uh, what, how, how does he say that? What, what? Holumbaga. Holumbaga? That's what I used to say. Holumbaga. <laughs> <laughs> I said, boobadaba. Oh, he comes in and says, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen that real video of the, of the comedian with the guitar? Ah! And the no. comedian hits the guy in the head with the guitar because he heckles him? Uh, no, it's like oh, really, is that real? It's like a really famous, yeah, it's pretty old, but, but he bashes a guy's head with a guitar. He doesn't kill him, he just but he puts a big hole in the back of the guitar. No, really, don't mess with me, because I don't come down to the bus station and slap the dick out of your mouth when you're working, do I? Oh, get on up here, motherfucker! 
Why would you ever consider harming another human with violence? I don't understand that. <laughs> That's a good point. That should be against the law or something, I think. Why would you ever even consider that as an option? Um, I think um, I think murder and violence um, should be illegal. Um, then less people would um, get robbed and hurt. I think, I think and, they um, should make about uh, mean, mean people uh, 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 into criminals because it's I think if you I think if you are mean, that should be against the law, and you should go be killed, and you should be killed uh, and shot. Yes, yeah, Zach, maybe pay attention. <laughs> he ran right by you. Is Thor really just trying to pick up like like little girls? Yeah, he's an elite. Figured. He's as elite as you can get. He was an Epstein's little black bug. <laughs> Every hero has to start somewhere. Now he's Epstein's little right? silver hammer. <laughs> <laughs> Epstein has a Thor hammer. So <laughs> <laughs> he broke out of prison the first time. <laughs> he accidentally killed himself with it. Yeah. No, it's, that's what really happened. The hammer literally like slammed through all the cameras, Epstein's hammer. knocked out all the guards on the way. Can, in, can we see a cool fan out of Epstein with Thor's hammer? <laughs> <laughs> the more well drawn it is, the better. Yeah, make it look like actually awesome. Put it on Reddit. Look too. at Drew's true sand picture. Yeah, see if you can get stupid Redditors to upvote it. You know what I want to talk about? What's that? Uh, more lineage stuff. You want to talk about lineage? Let's talk about Lyle's lineage. Yeah, Lyle. It is a proud one. What's Go your, on. Who's your favorite ancestor? Uh, my fr my favorite ancestor is uh, has got to be old uh, Augustus Lylebert, who came here on the bar. <laughs> and, and, and and what and he's famous Ow. for. I mean, we all know. Well, I mean, we, we, know, we know, we one. know, what, yeah, Lyle yeah. Burt, what, what, what Sir Lylebert was famous for. But can you just explain to the audience what? I mean, just enlighten them, basically. Well, he was a great conquerer. He great discovered man. malaria. He brought it to the Western world. <laughs> yep. Um, discovered AIDS too, by the way. Yeah, I think brought he that it. there too. Yep. Yeah, he's he's. Cre he he's not credited as the father of AIDS, no, which they, is they, a little bit of. <laughs> they don't give him credit. They don't give him. They should the be really father of AIDS. Yeah, no, I'm I'm kind of. He was kind of robbed, you know. Like he he wrote in uh, the Declaration of Independence, you know, like an AIDS. Too. The Declaration of AIDS. Yeah, the Declaration the of AIDS. What are you dependent. supposed to do here? Guys, I just thought of a new invention. It's called AIDS, <laughs> and there's more. <laughs> but wait. But wait. It gets better. <laughs> it's not just a good name. I say fuck Japan. This place sucks. It does, yeah. Let's uh, we'll I come back even here spread in a bit. AIDS here. Well, you got all those cookies already. I wouldn't even <laughs> spread AIDS here. She will not have a heart. Without her heart, she will fart. <laughs> <laughs> That's her fart stain on the floor. Did that big like meaty thing? <laughs> <laughs> all right, should I tell you about that art thing? Yeah, yeah go. What happened? Uh, it was the end of the day. Last class was art. I stood up, put my chair on my table like I was supposed to, put my bag on my back, said n not a word, staring into space, but suddenly this big monstrously fat bitch turns around, looks me in the eye, slaps herself in the eyeball, keeps her hand on her face, points at me and says, YOU THREW A NAIL IN MY EYE! And I was like, WHAT? And she's like, YOU! DETENTION! And I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? She was like, you threw a nail in my eye! And I was like, no I didn't, what are you talking about? I was just standing here. She's like, detention! Then I was like, okay. And then uh, I walked outside and my mom was parked there and I, I got into the car, just completely dumbfounded. And she's like, what's your problem? Like, I just got detention and my mom goes, oh for fuck's sake, Chris. What the fuck did you do this time? Like, I didn't do anything. The teacher said I threw a nail in her eyeball, and I don't know what the fuck she's talking about. My mom's like, oh, sh would you ever shut the fuck up? And I'm like, what? I didn't do anything! And I'm like, Mom, I swear to God, I didn't do anything. She just said I threw a nail in her eyeball. What sense does that make? I didn't even have a nail to begin with. My mom's like, so if I go in and talk to her, you're telling me she's, she's, she's like, lying. I'm like, yes! My mom's like, for fuck's sake. She gets out of the car, slams the door, she's really pissed off at me. Walks inside, and I'm just waiting in the car for ten minutes. Then my mom comes back out, sits down, dumbfounded. She's like, she's a fucking crazy bitch! I'm like, thank you! <laughs> and then it turns out she just didn't even mark me down for detention, she just forgot. Okay. She, she was just crazy. That's the worst, like, lie you could come up with, She too. was just crazy, I don't know what the fuck her problem was. She got- she got fired after we went on school tour. I think the last thing I ever said to her was, I like your stupid sunglasses. <laughs> Detention! Teenagers fucking suck. Um, teaching teenagers must be the worst. Like, 
I remember some of our teachers used to. That's why start... there's so many fucking videos of like teachers losing yeah. their shit. No, Those are really common. Our class. Oh, did I ever tell you about the the system for our school, where like the entry tests and shit? Did I ever tell you that? No. Our school was like, before you go into high school, you do an entry exam, and then they sort you into classes based on your intelligence. So the stupid kids were in one A one, and the really smart kids were in one A five. So the classes between one A two, one A. 1A4. Like, 1A3 was the most average kids, and that's where I was in. And, um, our, our for some reason, our very average class was the most, like, worst behaved in the whole school. And we, like, I didn't personally, but the kids in my school used to make our teachers cry daily. Like, like, burst into tears, and it was so fucking... I remember that. Terrible. That happened when I was in middle school, was that we were, there's only two grades that went to the school. And we were probably the tamest, like our grade in specific. We were all the tamest people. We never fucked with anyone, yeah. like teachers or anything. And become darkness itself. When we, this cutscene. <laughs> this cutscene is too autistic to continue. <laughs> Man, his back looks so buff it hurts. Look how it folds at the bottom. Yeah, uh, that's why my back looks like so. Your back is covered in scars, dude. Yep. For all my, all my trials. You mean, your 50 slip discs? Yes. Did I ever tell you about the time a disc slipped out my ass? And you had to put it- you had to swallow it and put it back in? <laughs> no. <laughs> it fell in the toilet, got flushed down. What happened to it? It's in the sewer. Went to a landfill? Yeah, it's my disc is out there. <laughs> Threatening to kill people is one of the funniest things you can do. We should make that legal. I don't know why it's illegal. It's so stupid. Is it illegal? That's bullshit. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh! Help me! Your privacy ends where my jokes begin. <laughs> like imagining a big fat dude with a fucking rifle be like, You can't make jokes about killing people, what the fuck? What are you talking about? Uh oh. All I uh, did was you. just send someone a picture of their daughter leaving school as a funny joke. What? If I, <laughs> if I can't photoshop my ex-wife dead, what can I do? <laughs> <laughs> you can do that, right? No, as long I as it's not a realistic death, Ooh. you can't put your ex-wife in like an elephant's mouth or something. You could like do that, but I don't. I think that would just be a strange thing to do, a waste of time even. <laughs> yeah, but I, that would undeniably mouth. kill her. I, I, you, you could really do that whatever you want, man. I mean, that, that you could do that, you could do it in a free country, but you probably could Photoshop her with like a realistic bullet wound or like in a casket or something. What, what if, what if you Photoshop her on like you know, you know, one of them uh, magician folks where they they saw their secretary in half? You're saying what if you what if you photoshopped your ex-wife to be sawed in half? Yeah, yeah, and and then you and then you put a little speech bubble next to the magician saying, "Oh God, oh God, it didn't work this time. Oh God, is that legal?" <laughs> we should talk to a lawyer. I bet that I bet that that would be, I bet that would be so transformative. It's like that's almost art. I think you could get away with that. I bet. There's a witch right I over mean, here. I mean, some people guys. consider murder an art, Zach. Okay, let's mine. Uh, let's fucking mine, guys. <laughs> Yo, uh, editor, put in some sick, like, Incompetech music right here. Put in, like, uh, sweet heavy metal. <laughs> from Incompetech, from, from Kevin with Cleod. Put on, Actually, uh, put on Netherland Shanty, that's, like, the coolest one he ever did. <laughs> like, Remember, that was the, the gnomes, the gnomes on Xbox 360. That song gives me heart palpitations. <laughs> it's really fucking scary. Well, okay. I'm not kidding. That gives that song gives me anxiety. I feel like I'm I feel like I'm having like a panic attack or some kind of stress. Because the recorders are out of tune. We gotta come up with some kind of goal, right? No, Otherwise, no, we're, we're just digging. I've got a good goal. Let's dance. Slightly. Let's have a dance. This is so cool. A dance party, and then we'll call this episode Minecraft Dance Party, and we'll have the coolest fucking thumbnail of all time. <laughs> yeah, and I think if we'll we'll call it uh, Cool Minecraft Dance Party. Send this your parents' credit card. I think it'll have about 400 million views. Um, <laughs> And I think, and I, this is cra this might sound crazy, but I think we're gonna buy a six million dollar house in Beverly Hills, and then I think one of us is gonna overdose. That's me. And uh, yeah, that's you. And then I'm gonna gain about four hundred pounds. Tomar is going to live a beautiful life, and there's no joke there. That's not funny. That's just cool. Tomar's gonna <laughs> dump Jaxie for some Minecraft like fangirl. Yeah. That's not true. <laughs> it's true. I can see it. I can see it already happening. And he's gonna build Tomartopia in real life. You're gonna build. Oh yeah, empire. this server's. Still called Tomartopia, isn't it? Yeah. Chris, there are people in the world that really look like that. What do you think about that? Monsters. What do you think they should do if they're listening to this and they look like exactly like that character? Swallow salt water. <laughs> <laughs> what is that gonna do? Let him return to the ocean. 
<laughs> oh, because they're like fat fucking whales. <laughs> I see what you're saying. I'm, just, I'm implying they're like gross, unevolved fish. I don't know. Oh, like like not even humans. They're fully. not even humans. Probably not even, don't even have souls or whatever. Yeah, is what a nasty person would say, but we don't say that. We don't say positive that. outcomes. They we return don't say to that. Their fish we just world. love those we low frame rate children, don't we? You know what's weird? I'm looking at the recording right now, and it doesn't look like that. Really? And it kind of looks like that. I don't know, but these guys have weirdly low frame rates in the background. No. You look at Joe Biden, he's got low frame rates, he doesn't even know <laughs> what he's at a distance, he's got lower frame rates. He's clipping through the ground, right? He doesn't even know what the hell is going on. His inverse kinematics are not set up correctly. <laughs> Davey, you used to be the best basketball player in the whole world. And now look at you. You're buff, prim, fit. <laughs> An alcoholic and have a hot girl and a little boy. And everybody uh, likes you and you're lovable. And you're huggable. Adam Sandler in real life. <laughs> You have millions of dollars? <laughs> You're in Hotel Transylvania. It was the, a good our, movie. Our studio that did a really good film prior didn't... Or I didn't the, grow up with the Goofy movie, but it's better than the Extremely Goofy movie, what? though. I still think the Extremely Goofy movie is fun, too. I, yeah, I think it's underrated. What about I, the Ridiculously Goofy movie? The anime- the character animation is pretty good. What about the literally stupid Goofy movie? <laughs> There's a somewhat Goofy movie, that's when Max Goof is middle-aged and it's depressing. <laughs> The probable Goofy movie. The undeniably Goofy movie. The somewhat disappointing I wanted Goofy on, movie. I wanted to linger on Mario. Fucking, oh my god, this think is gonna of, be so frustrating. Think of more Goofy Noofy Noofy names. <laughs> the Goofy Noofy Noofy. <laughs> goofy silly ha ha fun <laughs> movie. What was the funniest prank you ever pulled? One time I, I pushed my father into a knife and he died. I never did any funny pranks, unfortunately. One time my dad was walking by me and I was a kid and I saw it in the cartoon where another character sticks at his leg and they trip over. Oh, I uh, remember doing that. I did that to my dad and he just tripped and looked at me and went, yeah, What the just, fuck are you doing?! <laughs> they, people just get mad because you yeah. can get hurt. Yeah. He, he tumbled on his knees and got back up and put his fists up. <laughs> the fuck?! No, he literally just went, What the fuck are you doing?! And I was like, Eh! <laughs> How old were you, Chris? Um, six, seven. <laughs> there was another time- that makes, it, that makes it even funnier, you were so young and yeah. you got that anger. There was another time where I was just lying face down on the floor, just like doing nothing, and my dad walked into the room and he went, Chris? And I didn't- I did I just didn't look at him and he went, Chris! Oh god, I'm hiccuping. He went, Chris! Oh god, I'm hiccuping from screaming. <laughs> Fuck. I needed to get this joke. Sorry. He went, Chris! So fuck, I'm hiccuping every <laughs> I'm time. Sorry, Chris. Fuck. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Cause you went, Chris! Why, right? why am I hiccuping every time I scream? He went, Chris! Oh, I got it. I can't he went, not Chris, do it. We got it. <laughs> what did he do? Uh, I went. I looked around. I went, what? <laughs> and he was like, what the fuck are you doing? I was like, I'm just lying here. <laughs> and I was really young. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> why am I hiccuping? <laughs> I hate the hiccups. Cause it's funny. I like the, uh, the evolution of the word prank, because now, uh, the <laughs> most horrible thing you could ever do to somebody showing that you prank. have no respect for them in any way whatsoever is a prank. Oh, there's a tank! Where? Oh, oh. god! <laughs> uh, uh, right there! Um, look over there! <laughs> it's lit up. It's lit up like a big old Christmas tree. <laughs> He's throwing big old rocks at you. Boo. Oh, that scared the <laughs> fucking shit out of me, actually. Forgot He's it. down. The spitter looks so fucking scary. That went real fast. That's a classic joke from Left 4 Speed 2. Um, you are kind of scary, very scary, in fact. <laughs> That's not what he says. <laughs> it's pretty much the exact joke, though. Did I go um, the right you way? Are, you are very scary. <laughs> <laughs> um, could you be any scarier? I mean... <laughs> you should dub your own cartoon. Go back and dub it. Okay. Um, kind of awkward, kind of scary. Do you, do you, don't you love those uh, dubs? And I mean this really. Don't you love those dubs of your cartoons of like Spanish and German and shit? Some of them are it's actually pretty good, but other ones are not very good. I like the ones that are really bad. There's not, and I'm not, I'm not gonna single out anybody specifically except for this guy that I'm gonna put on screen. But <laughs> besides, <laughs> besides, no, I really do love it. Even when they're really bad, they the can be funny. If anybody needs it, was it was this the movie Hannibal where he takes the woods, the guy's head off and eats his brain? Yeah, that's scary. Yeah, yeah. So imagine that happens, right? There's a big like. Uh, Bunch of metal claws up right above your head, right? You're playing a cool VR game. But every time you die in the game, it takes a little- it stabs your brain, it takes a little piece off. <laughs> but it's like the best experience ever. Would you do it once? Oh yeah, I'd do it once. Would you do it, Chris? Eat my own brain? No, 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 no. No, no, the top of your brain's take it off like the movie Hannibal, right? Yeah. 
but there's a couple middle claws above your open head. You yeah. can't feel it. You don't feel weird. It's fine. Yeah. But so wait, how severe brain damage does it give you? So, which is what you told us. Yeah, basically, every time you die in the game, it's like VR, right? You have a little VR headset. It looks, it's the best experience, gaming experience you'll ever have in your life. But every time you die in the game, the little metal claws will poke your brain. I would never do that. Take a little piece off. But, it, but it's the best experience ever. I don't ever. care. I okay, would not you, do when that. When you say it's the best experience ever. You, you could say that about drugs. Wait, 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 I have a really, like... I have a really, really relevant question Oh, you do to this. meth. It's like the best feeling ever, <laughs> no, but it I makes you No, I have a really slightly... relevant question <laughs> to this. What? What? What is your perception of time in the game? What do you mean? It's what is your perception of time in the game? We'll give you, am we'll, I living a whole entire lifetime in an exchange for like a little piece of my brain, or am I like no? It's a, it's a no, 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 no. It's a regular video game. So, an hour in the game is an hour in real life. Yeah, yeah that exactly. sucks, dude. No, yeah, that kind of sucks. No, but it's the best gaming experience ever. This is the same as heroin and meth. No, it's not. Though, it is. How You're many gonna... gaming experiences do you have on heroin? I'm saying it's the same thing. It's the best feeling <laughs> in the world, but it makes you more dead and retarded. It's the no, same but it's shit. Just a li it's a little. It's like an atom of your brain gets peeled off. An this... atom. Okay. Oh, that's like drinking an a beer. Atom. An atom is nothing. Okay, dude. fine. That's no, like no, drinking fine, a fine, beer. Fine, I fine. do it's it. A, it's a grain of. It's a grain of sand. So it's like it's that's like it's like bad. it's like ten thousand neurons. That's pretty fucking bad. It's like ten thousand mm. neurons. One little neural connection. I wouldn't want to do that once. I wouldn't do that. But it's only when you die, by the way. It's only when you die in the game. So if you're really good, I do it once. They could add parts to your brain too if you're good at the game. I wouldn't do it, mate. I wouldn't do it. <laughs> Not for a million nonces in the world. What would you do? Like taking a grain oh, of sand yo! off your brain. That's you like fucking... get, that's like Why getting punched that? once, maybe. I'd do it. Why the fuck? I would I would do it at least once if it was the coolest gamer experience ever. I would do it once to say I did it. But yeah. In the game, by the way, that you're playing is Mario, but it feels like you're really in the game. Squashing Goombas, <laughs> saving the princess. What the fuck is better? Nothing. Nothing is better <laughs> than that. Ah. You know of the three blades. I know it refers to I the ate all three of them. Cooks and they hurt my tummy. <laughs> Did oh. you know that the I understand. I eat things from vending machines. <laughs> were also I have three Sonics traveling through my bowels right now. Protecting emperors. That's beautiful, son. With their razors, you keep knives, doing God's work. Did you look up Amy's skirt? <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing there. I saw you do it. <laughs> I, you should be ashamed. <laughs> I was looking at you from a bush. I was looking up your skirt. <laughs> How did you know? Did you ever see the uh, two-part television movie special where uh, the, one of the girls gets kidnapped and they change the theme song to say, Never knew how much I'll miss her. <laughs> How do you know the theme song? I only knew it because I watched my, Sister Sister. My sister sure. watched it because she was a girl. I'm pretty I sure sister, I sister. was it, it. I guess you wouldn't. Neither of you would know. I think it was on before Sabrina the Teenage Witch, and that's for, no. Yes, Sister Sister. It was on before I'm Sabrina. Down with my own mind. I'm gonna be bound from dang and don't and then, <laughs> and then Boy Meets <laughs> World was on afterwards. Need you get inside of me. And I never. <laughs> 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 That's I never what the show's about. They're trying to merge together. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I remember there was a version of that opening. Like, you know, where they like re record openings? They did, I yeah. But I forgot there they was did a, a version remix of that version. opening where they go, Sister, Sister! It used to piss me off as a little boy. <laughs> Zach, if you had that super alien computer it's getting and bad could go bad. back and look at your life from different angles, would you do it? Uh, yeah, I would do it. What would you do if you, like, went back to, like, your birthday as a seven-year-old and you saw your mom just, like, fucking hate that kid? <laughs> fucking... I pretend... See, this is the problem, Would though. you still love your mom if you, like, found out that, like, she was just kind of... put her in the swimming kinda... pool and tell you what a ladder, bitch. <laughs> you would have to because... Just kidding, mommy. Look at oh that. It's God. like Dr. Manhattan. Oh, yeah, when he reappears as a... As a, as a vascular system? Rematerializes as a... What does he say? As a vascular... Vascular... As a vascular man. No, you know, it's, I, I've thought about the god computer so many times, but I always think about, like, what... Imagine type, if you had a god computer, you typed in, like, show me the first joke ever told. And it's, like, one million years ago, and it's, like, a monkey looking at, like, another monkey's erect cock and, like, pointing and laughing. <laughs> and then, like, that was the first joke ever, you know what I mean? Like, what was the first... There had to be a first joke ever told. 
Like, uh, a th like a thing, like a thing laughing at something that was funny. Yeah, it was, it's probably just like the word poop or some was, some shit like that. <laughs> it was like, probably just blah, 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 and everyone laughed. Or just something funny that happened, like a guy getting his head caved in or something. They pointed and laughed at it. Probably not, yeah, not that, but you know what I mean. Oh, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. What would, what would make you guys laugh? If I was a caveman? If you were like a if you were no not even like a, you you were like a missing link. Cause think about it, monkeys. <laughs> why is that funny? Why is missing link funny? I don't know. I, I thought you were implying Lyle was the missing link. <laughs> no, I was not even saying. <laughs> what the fuck? I think you could I'm send saying... me back like a thousand years and everything would basically turn that out was bad the shit same. Crazy. Okay, Matt, your brain is exposed. <laughs> Look at a hypothetical. That's it. <laughs> I'd be dead. I'd what go into some sort do? of. I'd go into some sort of coma. Or, okay, and die. Matt, you, your brain is exposed, and and boy, is it embarrassing. <laughs> it's, re it's real embarrassing. No, this is not good. <laughs> Can't believe I came to the ball like this. <laughs> okay, Matt, would you rather have your brain be exposed or your heart be exposed? I would die regardless. No, you wouldn't. Not necessarily. I think if your heart's exposed, you'd be fine. You wouldn't die it, regardless. The the yeah, because in surgery, that your heart's exposed. I guess your brain is exposed in surgery. Too. And by exposed, I don't mean it's bloody and out. Yeah, but the brain is more I mean, sensitive than the your heart, heart is the on the is outside of sensitive. your rib cage, beating away. You know, if I if I barely if if say I have my brain exposed, if like let's say a bug comes and lands on my brain, <laughs> it's gonna fucking kill you me. Forget the letter B. Yeah, <laughs> but like my heart, it's like I think that's more okay, and it's easier to control like the area around my in my brain. I can't really see what's going on, but my heart that's right in front of me. And okay, I'm, Matt, um, what would you rather? Um, your brain be exposed with no skull, or your heart be on top of your skull, beating away? Wait, no what? skull. So it's just a brain in his head now. He doesn't have a skull. Yeah, so he has like a gelatinous blob. That's what I was. That's what I meant. I don't the like these images. They're disturbing. That's, I love them. That's why I'm saying them. I wanna, Stop. I just want to switch a little head around. Matt, your brain is pulsing without a skull, on top of your head like the fucking Mars Attacks aliens, <laughs> or you have a skull. What if all the veins on your body were ten times larger? Oh my god, that's gross. <laughs> that's gross. But my my brain without a skull and just a pulsing. Y you know, I said, w would you rather have the the exposed brain on your skull? I'd rather or have none of this. Fucking answer. Would you rather have the brain exposed? My, I'd rather have my heart on top of my head. That would look more normal than having just a fucking brain. But if 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 fucking someone came over and slapped you in your head, your heart would explode. And you'd if die. someone slapped Why my brain, I would die. Explode? Not necessarily. <laughs> yeah, you go. No! <laughs> or you get really smart. <laughs> <laughs> Slap you in the brain, you just go. go. I know everything about politics. Oh. oh, I see it. Okay, sweet. You think you're like a South Park character saying "sweet"? What the hell? Remember when Carmen used to go "sweet"? She's so sweet. Hey, Brian. Oh, She's Peter, we're stuck in Minecraft. Peter, this is worse than the time we got stuck in Minecraft and you built an obsidian tower. <laughs> so shit. An obsidian yeah. tower. <laughs> oh, do you mind if I heal myself real quick? I don't mind yeah, anything. Sure. Like, I'm pretty dumbed down for anything, Dude, really. Dude, he's really fucking chill, man. I keep telling you guys this. Whoa. Oh, shit. Chris is super open-minded, he's yeah. down for anything, I, dude. Just, just don't step on his toes, I'm, man. I just love don't... how, like, sexually and, like, like intellectually open you are. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm down for pretty much anything. Chris is down to fuck, suck, anything you wanted to do. I mean, it's actually kind of incredible. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's such a giving man, you can live in his house, you can Literally piss in every his possible mouth, sex you can... Dude, it's, I, it's wait, expression. stop! I'm not any kind of fucking closed-minded egghead, I love fucking my friends. It's so <laughs> nice to bond with them in that way. <laughs> The other if day you guys I was like, man, I'm feeling, friends, I'm what feeling... are you doing? Play Xbox yeah, together, other... hanging out? Oh. The other day I told Chris, I, I said, I, I'm feeling real sexually repressed. You know what he did? He just gave me his social security number. Just gave yep. it to me. And that's what he did. I mean, <laughs> and that's why, and that's why, that's why we've all stayed friends so long. And then yeah, just because exactly. the fucking suck it. It's because the security, social security stuff you're talking about. Yeah. Wait, Oh my! No, it's 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 a it's a level of closeness, you know. Like if you don't get like passionately intimate, it's like this it's not a real pretty friendship. Fucking hard. You know? Get ready. See you low. can't think purely in the long term, right? Yeah. Especially until he gets some more health. You're right. You're right. Listen, Chris. Ooh. Yeah. Tomar knows his stuff, man. I know he's a smart. 
Look, <laughs> Tomar's your dad, and I'm your cool uncle when it comes to this game, right? You're my stinky yeah. uncle. Uh... I'm trying to, I'm trying to push like the the weed of one on you, <laughs> and the, the heavy metal music. Tomar's just trying to get you into a good college, right? <laughs> yeah. You don't want to be like me. You want to be like him. No, I know. I do. I know. <laughs> that said, I do have a thousand girlfriends, so you know. <laughs> but they're all stupid. They, they are. What the fuck? <laughs> they all hate you. <laughs> <What is that? laughs> they do. <laughs> Tomar, you like know the fucking secrets of this I don't know any game. of them. Tomar, how hard I did you laugh? I have forgotten them. How hard did you laugh when Rob Walker ran in dressed as Santa Christ <laughs> and he said, Is that secret? Is that safe? Tomar. I, I don't- here's a, here's, <laughs> Tomar, here's a scenario. I you don't- were I, to, You were trying to give- You were trying to get pregnant with your wife, if you know what I'm saying. Okay. Yeah. You, your wife, you're, you're trying to get your pony wife pregnant. Like a tubby wubby pony yes, wife there. Yes, and she says to you, Melvin, oh. Melvin, brother, the Joker, Melvin, Melvin. Now, how quickly do you come? Is it A, one second, <laughs> B, and you look hey. down, and you look down, hey. and like, hey. you look down, and the, and the, you look down, as, as your oh. bedroom light's flashing, yeah. the one scary frame her face is that of Melvin, brother, the Joker. Who's Melvin, brother of the Joker, by the way? <laughs> he's Melvin. Melvin, brother, the Joker. Melvin, bro, it's, it's one of Doug Walker's earliest videos where he's dressed up as Heath Ledger's Joker. <laughs> he led, he led go Joker. And it's considered one of his unfunniest videos, <laughs> but I, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna, gonna fucking lie to get, myself. You gonna come with the bad form on this one? I literally, me, me and my friend Jack, when we were like that, at the age when that came out, oh, we, we no, thought that was the funniest no. shit. <laughs> that came out like 2015, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that was three no, years ago. No, no, it came out, right. no, that was one of his earliest fuck. that's like 10 years old, almost. How old do you think you were, like, like 16? Pro 16 or 17, I don't know. I was too old. A, Seventeen's a bit too old, yeah. Yeah. It was like 14 or 15, it's okay. Julian, close Fucking your eyes! <laughs> okay. Visualize what I tell you to. Visualize a million I'm gonna make flies. you not depressed. Okay? I don't know about that. Vis close your vision. <laughs> okay. You're on a big, fat island. Oh, how fat is it? Surrounded by breeze. It's jiggling, it's so fat. The like, sand... Like, brie cheese? Close your fucking eyes, they Julian! They were closed, then you stopped. <laughs> Julian, you're standing on a beach of pink sand. Mm -hmm. You're closing your eyes You're, you're crunching your- you're crunching your toes into the pink sand, okay. right? There's a little tiny prawn, he crawls out of oh, the no. water. I don't want it. He says, you are at peace. <laughs> okay. I love you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, eat me. <laughs> okay, you ate it, right? Yeah. Now, you you, sw you, you taste the, the prawn between your big yellow teeth. Uh-huh. The gaps of your teeth expand. Uh-huh. Now, now you're growing more teeth. Uh -huh. Now, you're at peace. <laughs> He's dead! <laughs> Chris, what did you do? Here we go. Good job, Chris. Thanks, Papa. Thanks, Pop-Up, Pop-Up. My Papa, Pop-Up. What if your Papa was a Pop-Up? Poppy, Pop-Up. <laughs> I am the father who pops up. Oh. Is that, this is Halloween? I am the man who pops right up. <laughs> I am the woman who flops right over. <laughs> that doesn't even rhyme. <laughs> I am the man who lies right down. I am the man who sometimes frowns. <laughs> mm. <laughs> you like that? Crouch! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your head got smashed I, even worse. I was really expecting it to work. Yeah, me too. You got squished like a bug. Uh, Said it like it was the most obvious thing in the world. Wait, oh. wait, wait, wait. I think it just wants me to sprint. I think I just didn't sprint early enough. You weren't sprinting? I this was, is like Sonic Adventure 2. They stole they stole that from Sonic Adventure 2. When you're, when you're, yeah, when you're Woo! running away from the car. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> uh, <laughs> I wish he sung better like that. Why does he sing like ruling it? Like, shut up. No, no. It's like, there you go. That yep. guy that guy is eating too many uh he needs he needs more beef, he needs more steak, he needs he needs male super male vitality, he needs to be red. He needs to have red skin to sing like a pro. Have you yeah, seen exactly. the video of him crushing the ice cream tub between his thighs? <laughs> he says it was 40 pounds of tension that he applied, and that's how he named <laughs> his band. Did you see the video of Sonic the Hedgehog? And this was just leaked <laughs> recently. Sony's trying to cover it up, but Sonic has a bucket of centipedes, and he pulls them out and crushes them between his toes. <laughs> and like centipedes. moans in ecstasy. It's probably one of the most disturbing <laughs> vids I've seen. This sounds like something uh, Shadow would do. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like a shadow move, but apparently he's like super mm. nice in person. Yeah, apparently, well, it's the opposite. It's yeah. like, you know, the people that present themselves that way, generally, they've got 
you know. Yeah, they got I, centipedes under their. They've feet got centipedes in their closet. Skeletons in their closet. They've yeah. got centipedes in their in their toes and, and skeletons <laughs> in their closet. That's exactly right. You ever notice that society started going backwards once Sonic was created? I That's think true. about that almost by daily, <laughs> but I think it's just a coincidence. Nah, it's no, no, it's I mean, exactly. Hear, on hear point. me what out. What year was though, Sonic cause, invented? Because like like ninety one. Wait, wait, wait. What year was Bill Clinton elected? Two. No. To cure two. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I created Sonic. I made Sonic. <laughs> it was made the whole time. It was time. a side You must crush it to peace between your toes now. <laughs> I created okay, Sonic. Okay, Bill Clinton. <laughs> Hillary <laughs> created Amy. <laughs> Hillary is based on Amy. I mean, I, I mean, I mean, Amy's based on Hillary. It's based on Amy. <laughs> Tomorrow, if you were gonna take a big fucking, let's say you had Taco Bell, fuck? and you had to take a big fucking disgusting shit, and then you went to your toilet, and you saw a disgusting serpent in your toilet, would you grab it by the neck and smash it against this toilet bowl? <laughs> or B, Ooh. what else would you do? If I saw a serpent in my toilet, would I grab it yes. by the neck? No. That's correct. I would run. I would shut How the door you, to my bathroom. Did you actually run from a snake uh, in your toilet? Yes! Why? Because I'd assume someone but, was but, trying to murder me. But what if you looked at it? I would, in fact, I would ass I would check the rest of the house immediately what you, after. But what did you think to look or at it? I would it leave the house. What did you think what did you think to smile and look at it and go da 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 da? And what if it started dancing to you? <laughs> no! Da 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 I wouldn't interpret it as dance. I would, I would just assume that it was getting ready to to strike. <laughs> it's gonna bite you because you're singing a little song to it. I wouldn't sing the song to I it. Think you would? You go, body do, gotti puppet. There's a place what in if, France. What if 15 rabbis came in and started singing to it? Said Tomar, you know what you must do. Bobby D, Bob, Oh skipping. fuck! <laughs> At least you got the barrel. This is obviously building up to we're something, guys, you guys. We, look, we actually like this. We're just being trolls. We do love it. We're friends with the developers. We're just kind of being internet He's trolls. here right now. You want to you want to introduce yourself? He's big guy Clyde the whole time. Check this out. Oh. Hi. So what inspired you to make? Oh wait, one sec. Oh. <laughs> what did you? Just, oh sorry. Uh, oh my. Oh that one. Chocolate soil is so good. Do you want some more? You say <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on, come on, man. come on, come on, I'm going fucking crazy, dude. I'm gonna shoot you. So, so what inspired you? I'll let you finish that. Well, you did a very good job. Fuck you. What? <laughs> you can no tell. <laughs> no tell. Now you can go in. <laughs> <laughs> the future is fucking awesome. Uh, it's pretty fun. It always makes you. Who's that big fucking goofy ape in the background? Is that an orangutan? You. What? What'd you call? It's a it? big fucking goofy ape. Ape. I can't say that about the president. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I can. What? what that's, not, that's not. We don't have Obama anymore, Chris. What the fuck are you talking about Obama for, Julian? You said ape. You are racist, Mr. Oh. Dude, one time I was at a dinner table uh, with my family <laughs> from like the deep south. Yeah. And uh, it was like silent, and my little cousin was like, ah, Obama looks like a monkey. <laughs> <laughs> it was just silent at the table, and his parents laughed. <laughs> his parents <laughs> laughed. <laughs> I think that's it was really funny, though. They were slamming their fists in on the table, <laughs> making all the cuddlers <laughs> fucking shake. Yeah! Mashed potatoes <laughs> flying out of their mouths. You're right, he does! <laughs> <laughs> that's my boy! Is it, is it, are his parents John K? <laughs> I don't know. Oh man. So is this really the last Crash Bandicoot we knew and loved? Or no. Is this a new one? This is like the 50 millionth one. Every time he teleports, he's dead. Isn't that how teleportation works? Well, there, I mean, that's, that's I mean, not a be, thing. It, we can't teleport <laughs> yet. Yeah, we can. How do you think they got Obama to Sweden? How do you think they got Obama to the moon? <laughs> how do you think they got Obama? They teleported, the <laughs> they teleported one. him from the moon. Obama was the resort of the resort. Resort Osama. of the violence. <laughs> Osama, Osama was the report. <laughs> He's not Osama. <laughs> Obama He's not Osama. was the result. <laughs> Osama was the report. I did. A, I did a book report on Osama bin Laden, He's and then not. we used to teleport and return him sorry. into Obama. My brain has holes in it. And I can't speak properly. Your brain has holes in it. Holy moly! Does it really? I don't know. I wouldn't be surprised if I had fucking um, Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's, because my ability to communicate it just gets worse and worse. Yeah, me too. 
I think you're. Oh no, you got it. Ooh, we get to go to Egypt. We got to make a deal with a lady who might turn everybody back. We got to make a deal with Aladdin. I would love to see Aladdin fly through that little hole right there and, and, and come into the adventure. <laughs> I can show you my hole. <laughs> and he says, Look, Aladdin. it is right here. I bleached it and shaved it and poured <laughs> oil on it. <laughs> and that's what caused all the redness <laughs> right around here. <laughs> He's pointing to it. Ignore this little thing. It is simply benign. There's a sweet uh, katana over here. I got a sweet cat. Why do you always say stupid dorky shit like that, Lyle? Why? You're the big, uh, well, because I didn't spend 13 years mastering the art of Bushido oh. for nothing? Ooh. What the fuck? Oh. <laughs> I landed that right on you. That was fucking weird. <laughs> 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 Ooh, oh, boomer. Boomer. Yeah, you got my god, my god. Look, Lyle, the dynamic uh. is obvious. I am the sex appeal, Chris is the brains, Tomar is... The ones who yeah. build rocket ships, and you are the uh, you're the you're the nerd character that like paints figurines. How come there's the brains, the nerds, and the rocket ship guy? <laughs> paints figurines. Listen, man, the, Henry Cavill is all those things, and he the paints obvious figurines dynamic. all the time. Henry Cavill's a big Warhammer fan, and you should give him Instagram likes for being a Warhammer fan. Yeah, he was paid sixty thousand dollars to say that yeah, fucking lie. He was paid ninety eight thousand dollars to paint that fucking. He, he broke it in half when yeah. he was painting it. Who who said that painting Warhammer uh -oh. figurines never pay the bills? Certainly no. not my dad. Anyway, Julian, let's do a new a new, a new song. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. Okay. Okay, that's that doesn't help when you go scoop 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 to random notes. You have to keep the notes similar. Okay, it's good. Better than time. Okay. That doesn't help, Julian. I don't know how to carry a song. Just go. Marrow. Bone marrow. Okay, good. Keep doing that. Okay, that didn't help. Sorry. Fuck. I fucked that one. Let's do a song about Goofy's poopy. I'll roll my. I'll make them into shorts. I got these. I got these in Japan. They're too short for me because all Japanese people are short. Do people say white pig go home? <laughs> yeah. I really like that quote. It sounds really funny. It's because they say white do pig white go do home. Pig. Do they really? Yeah. There's Japanese video people the, say the, the They didn't call me a white pig. There's the video of the Japanese nationalist at the uh, no. the airport yelling at them saying white do pig go home, <laughs> and no one understands them. That's cool. They they just look at them and kind of smile and walk that's, away. That's like my anime. It's like what my the people Japanese here talk funny. Beningis. They talk like in my anime. In all my anime, when they say white pig go home. Tomar, why can't you draw like that? Draw like what? Like this game? Yeah. Cause I suck at drawing. I don't know. <laughs> that is such a horrible why attitude. Why can't you draw like this, huh? I can. I'm. I'm very much better. Prove it. it. Draw something for this episode. Puts it on screen right now. You're not gonna do that. You know, you're not gonna do that. <laughs> Just use something I drew like five years ago. I'm gonna fucking ago. message you at 4 a.m. the day before this goes out, and I was like, oh yeah, I totally forgot. Did you want to draw something for this episode? <laughs> and you're gonna say yes, and then you're gonna not do it. <laughs> I'll draw it. Okay. Yeah, it will kick ass. All right. And then I'm gonna put an extra Definitely drawing right here. Definitely don't edit this out regardless of what he oh, decides yeah, to do. And put an extra drawing right here too. So three drawings. And then post your uh, reaction to them as, as a picture right here. Put hardcore porn right here. Don't do that. That would make me fucking frown. I uh, hate seeing pornography. I hate seeing other people have sex. Only I wanna. Did I ever tell you uh, what happened to my brother? I was nope. sloppy. He was like... A bird? Yeah, Bert. When we were in a, a car when we were younger, uh, we were on the way to get a tire swing, and when we got to the place, it was like on this dusty hill, and he got into the tire like just to sit in it, see if he liked it, and started rolling yeah. down the hill towards our car, which the door was open. Yeah, yeah. And just sliced his head clean off. Oh, yeah, okay, they don't hurt you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did you ever tell a story about how you actually convinced me when we like like the? Do you have the a first, fake brother? Did I convince Bert? you? You convinced me like within the first year when Chris, we started talking. Chris, you have talking. a fake brother? Yeah. 
No, when I first started talking to Chris, like 2010, I made that up for you. You did. That's I how that happened. That. That's how that happened. He, I, yeah. He, no, but the thing is, the lie was not. The lie was not even as ridiculous as that. The lie when he told me that was like, oh yeah, I have a brother Bert, and the lie was that he was really good at swimming and you were jealous. <laughs> That was the only lie, and he never laughed or said just kidding. He mentioned it casually, and then like like nine months later, I was like I was like oh yeah something something. And I was like oh your brother. He's like what are you talking about? I was like your your brother who swims. His brother Bird. He's like what are you fucking talking about? So but it was like the most believable regular like normal lie. So I know <laughs> the gaslighting goes back so it far. It does. Yeah, it goes way beyond Hercule. It goes back to Bert O'Neill. Oh Hercule? What? Hercule. I convinced Zach that there was a character in Hercules called Hercule, and that he, he was, was a, smaller a smaller version of Hercules. <laughs> it's true, and I believed it. I'm usually, I'm usually pretty. I usually have my wits about focus. me. That kind of <laughs> I can't time any of these jumps. Omar, you're you're just a cute little fella. Aww. Aww, sweetie. <laughs> Fuck. One of my teachers fucking fell out. Your teeth? What are your teeth just fell off? You hear that? Are you like in one of those teeth dreams? No. This Wait, is Chris, a, Chris, let me see. Open your, Chris, open your uh, mouth. Uh, it really is his tooth. He's wow. chewing on it. This is a tooth reality, not a tooth dream. You think I can break it down and swallow yeah, it? Yeah, try it, try it. Just take a bite of it. Oh, oh you actually did. Oh, dude, there's goo inside. Oh, it's tooth gone. Goo. What is that, that green stuff on the inside? Oh, dude, that's that tooth oil. <laughs> tooth oil? Yeah. The no. most precious wait, 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 he swallowed valuable tooth oil? He swallowed no, 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 valuable no. tooth oil. <laughs> we gotta pump his wait, stomach wait, to get it out. Wait, 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 that, dude, that, 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 that. Wait a second! Oh. Wow! Oh. Alright. Hey, Chris, can you give me one of your teeth? I see another one's kind of loose. Can you give, can you give me one? Uh. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know. I think I'm. I might have to sneak faster. Yeah, I don't think you're supposed to go. I just there. tried. I'm trying to pull him out. Just give me one. I can't. This one, while you're being selfish, give me one. Oh. Oh, okay, cool. Thank you. I popped one out too. <laughs> Alright, oh. Oh, so, god damn, that's good. Dude, right? Chris, you should sell these, man. Oh my god. It's because I've been uh, chewing on, like, sugar cubes all oh. my life. Oh sugar my god. Sugar cubes. Do you? How did that song go again? Oh, yeah. It's just the Nutcracker song. Yeah, that's not a thing Steven Spielberg wrote. Oh, shit, you're right. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> that is in every trailer from the 90s. That's true. It's on all my old VHS tapes. You know what else was in every song? That's in the movie? Nutcracker? Yeah. That's when they crack his nuts and everyone dances <laughs> around him. <laughs> Remember the one episode when Chucky gets stuck to the ceiling? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's when Stu walks in, he's like, look at my new invention, and it explodes, and the babies explode onto the ceiling. <laughs> and they have to use a garden hoe to scrape them off. <laughs> Didi comes in and says, Stu, get the kids off the ceiling. Dr. Lichet <laughs> says it's not good. What if this is what Stu sees? <laughs> yeah, this is how he views the world. It's not that's the what... babies at all, it's just how he perceives his babies. <laughs> <laughs> Every night he has a dream. <laughs> Every night he's about to kill his son, and then he sees this shit. He's like, <laughs> I'll spare him tonight. <laughs> the moment my child is boring, I will kill it. <laughs> I think as long as you're really good at the game, you can't possibly die. Well, I've got bad news for you. I've been playing it for like 20 minutes, so. <laughs> So, well, that means, so that means you're really, really good. Baby turtles are only born for zero seconds before they run into the water, so... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait, what do you mean? When baby turtles are born, they have to just run. They have they to run fucking as fast run! As they can yeah, the they're water. getting chased by all of the scary fucking, like, scarecrow demons. They're all running after scarecrows them. Scarecrows and people on the beach going, <laughs> ah! Like, picking up these turtles. <laughs> yeah, I'm not kidding. They have to run away from, like, scary snapping deities. That's that really scary. Imagine being a little turtle running for your life and there's these big fucking primates like grab picking you up and grabbing you. <laughs> primates. Oh, I've got like a dodge. I did not Look know that. Those fucking pink primates. <laughs> I do always consider pink primates to be the most beautiful. Yeah, well, that's like why you're not like the rest of us. I'm beige. I'm like I'm very bright. You are. You're just a bright little. Beige. You're bright little beige. You're my bright little beige, beige. You're my bright little beige, and if I ever tell you otherwise, I must be drugged out of my mind or insane. Oh my god, she is Bayesian. Babe, if I ever want to break up with you, commit me to the fucking insane asylum, because I'm something's wrong. <laughs> <laughs>
That's so fucking cool and beautiful. <laughs> I think I might use that on my babe. I think I might steal that. You don't care, do you? <laughs> it on the box. <laughs> what? What's your favorite color of pikemen? Pikemen? <laughs> yeah. Originally the game was called Pikemen. It was about tribal people. And then everyone like Nintendo said, no, 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 don't do this. <laughs> they were pikemen and they were pikeys for short. Pikeys. Come here, you fucking pikey. <laughs> And then a Nintendo got deleted. Miyamoto has the famous quote where he said, Pike should take a hike. <laughs> <laughs> Pikeys should take a haiku. <laughs> haiku. <laughs> 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 <laughs>